Tamatoa hasn't always been this glam. I was a drab little crab once. Now I know I can be happy as a clam. Because I'm beautiful, baby. Did your granny say, listen to your heart. Be who you are on the inside. I need three words to tear her arguments apart. Your granny lied. I'd rather be shiny. Like a treasure from a sunken pirate wreck. Scrub the deck and make it look shiny. I will sparkle like a wealthy woman's neck. Just a sec. Don't you know? Fish are dumb, dumb, dumb. They chase anything that glitters. Beginners. Oh. And here they come, come, come. To the brightest thing that glitters. Hmm. Fish dinners. I just love free food. And you look like seafood. Seafood. <laughs> well, well, well. Little Maui's having trouble with his look. Your little semi-demi mini-god. Ouch! What a terrible performance. Get the hook, get it? You don't swing it like you used to, man. Yet I have to give you credit for my start. And your tattoos on the outside. For just like you, I made myself a work of art. I'll never hide. I can't. I'm too shiny. Watch me dazzle like a diamond in the rough. Strut my stuff. My stuff is so shiny. Send your armies, but they'll never be enough. My shell's too tough. Maui man, you could try, 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 but you can't expect a demigod to beat a decapod. Look it up. You will die, die, die. Now it's time for me to take apart. Your aching heart, oh, far from the ones who abandon you, chasing the love of these humans who made you feel wanted. You tried to be tough, but your armor's just not hard enough. My way, now it's time to kick your hiney. Ever seen someone so shiny? Soak it in, cause it's the last you'll ever see. Say la vie, mon ami. I'm so shiny. Now I'll eat you, so prepare your final plea. Just for me. You'll never be quite as shiny. You wish you were nice and shiny. <laughs> and now, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, people of all, it's Jeep's Variety Show! And now, here's your host, Look who's here, from above, up above, hello everyone, hello everybody, Jeep here of Jeep's Variety Show, how's everyone doing today, uh, Sumio, thank you for the host, Luna, thank you for the host, and no, I did not steal Fig's wife, she came here voluntarily, <laughs> okay, no, <laughs> alright, nice to see you all tonight, I hope everyone's doing well this fine evening. Let's, uh, we all know why y'all here. We are here for the beautiful, wonderful Usu. But, before we get to that, let's see what's in the news today. Well, I found a lucky penny, and then it exploded. Ouch! Also, in other news, I lost one million pounds. Not pounds as in weight, one million pounds as in money. But... Yeah, and that really pissed me off. I lost it. I can't fucking find it. I don't know where the million pounds went. Somewhere. 
I'm hoping it didn't go into the void, because Fig doesn't like giving away stuff. Certainly not for free. And, um, well, let's talk about some good news. In good news, the B, however... <laughs> I had you going there for a second. The B found my million pounds, but and and as evidently I left it in um in someone else's car. Now I'm not gonna tell you whose car that was, but evident that but that's where I left it. Anyway, uh, the one million pounds, however, the B told me that the million pounds in our world is only the equivalent of one dollar here, so there was no real need to worry about the million pounds. I knew there's a reason why I didn't really care about it, but um. He sent it back anyway, because the bee is nice like that, so. And that goes on my topic of why the million pounds Fig would not give back. If it's the equivalent of one crisp dollar, we all remember what he did in the void. And with Louie and all that shit, he did it all for a dollar. But the bee gave it back to me, so I have my million pounds equivalent to one dollar. I should probably take it to a currency exchange. There's like several boxes carrying these million pounds. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> And that's it for the news today. Sumiel says, that's not a penny. That's a landmine. It was not a landmine. It was, it was a penny. I know a penny when I see one. Lucky pennies in our world either explode on you or grant you a wish. Okay, that's how it works. And I had to take the chance. Luna says, and your only penny exploded too. Yeah, I know. I know. And spent it. I don't know if I spent it exactly, Luna. No, I don't think I spent it. No. No, 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 no. <laughs> all right, folks, we all know why you're here. We got a jam-packed show for you here tonight. I hope you're all going to stay to the video to the very end, or as long as you can, because let's get on to the introductory. Introductory. <laughs> There's her name right up above there. Y'all can see it, I hope. And let me just situate myself on the master's chair. Okay. <clears throat> Fig says, ugh. Usuki. Usuki. Sounds like a hoe. Well, Fig, you would know. And no, she's not. Okay? Alright. I understand you get certain privileges, but come on. Wait, Luna says for show. Oh, dear me. Oh, dear me. We picking on my guest already? Is that what was, is this, what this come down to? Fig says, oh no, she is. Alright, fine. I'll take your word for it, but I'm gonna ask her when she gets on the show. Sumio says, me English no bueno. What is hoe? Are you really inquiring for that, Sumio, or are you just fucking around? It means whore. It's, it's short for that. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> I, yeah, thank you, Luna. Luna says it. Whore. Sumio, I knew. I just wanted to bait. Okay, I thought so. I thought so, you piece of shit. Okay, anyway, let's not dilly-dally right now, okay, folks? So... She's mean, she's blue, she's betty, it's the mighty, give a warm welcome for Usuki! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> welcome, Usu, welcome to the show. How you doing, betty? Hey, hi, doing good. Yeah. Good is good. Now, Okami David says, Yo no hablo inglés que es hor. You speak Spanish, <laughs> Okami? Luna says, Usu. No, no habla español. No habla español? Fix it, no habla isekai. <laughs> no habla isekai. You don't speak isekai. Okay. <laughs> Luna says, It sounds like you're going to be wrestling her. I... <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Someone's wrestling her, right? Oh, David's Mexican. Cool, you're Mexican. That's so cool. I didn't know that, Okami. Nice. Um, anyway. Usu, we'll get right to the question that was brought up in the chat if you were present. Is, yeah. there, are, is there any credit to their accusations? Uh, that, that, that I'm a whore? I mean, yes. um, close. Close. Maybe. There yes. you go. Close and maybe. <laughs> That's not the same as confirmation, folks. Mark, write that down. I thought so. I knew you were all being too jumpy jumpy to the gunny gunny. What the hell? Fig says she's a hoe. Okami says a sorry uh, man. F Fig is my husband, so th so we, we do have that. Okay. All right. Sumio says, I'm pretty sure Usuki is a Pokemon. <laughs> no. Um, I don't think so. If she were... No, but I do like Pokemon. Yes. Pokemon. Oh, 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 oh,
you know, I'm, I'm starting to regret making Sumio a mod. Let's just get right on to the, to the questioning, shall we, Yusu? <laughs> Thank you so much for coming on the show. It's a delight to have you, actually. Yeah, yeah, wonderful to be here. Yeah, no, no, thank you, for reals. <laughs> I've always found uh, your demeanor a delight, so that's why I'm like, I gotta get Uso on the show. Not, not just because Fig brought up that you uh, that I didn't ask you, okay? Just to state the record, Fig, okay? You didn't... <laughs> just to state the record, it wasn't his It wasn't his doing? No, it's not. It's all me. Me, 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 me. Okay, Fig says she does pass the Harkness test. I mean, I regret you making a Sumi, making Sumio a mod. <laughs> you regret it, because you're a fellow mod. You're you're in conflict with my, with my Sumio mod. Okay. Let's go to an easy one. What's your favorite food and least favorite food? Um, favorite food. Uh, yeah. Favorite food is definitely sushi. Sushi, nice. Sushi is yes. Sushi is all time favorite. Any, um, any particular like? And uh, then yeah, yeah. Go on. Sorry. No. Uh, uh, the particular one. Um. I I would I would think octopus actually. Taco? No way. <laughs> Uh, octopus sushi and uh, and uh, just any any kind really. Wow. Eel. Okay. Have you had eel? Unagi? Hell yeah. Yes. I've had unagi fresh water, and I've had anago, which is salt water. Yeah, and then okay, so least favorite food, uh, to tomatoes. <gasps> I love tomatoes. <laughs> yeah, to tomatoes will literally kill me. So. Oh. Uh, they're my least favorite. Okay, now I get why you said that sandwich would kill you instead of Fig's lewd <laughs> comment. Let's yep. acknowledge it. Yep, yep. Got it, got it. Okay, so tomatoes, bleh, kill you. Okay, let's not talk about ones that will kill you. How about something you've tried and just didn't like the taste of? <laughs> I, can't, I, I, I honestly can't think of any. I love all food. Oh, nice. It's my favorite. Ah. Uh. You know, unless Sumio makes it, and then and then it's it's awful. Yes, absolutely agreed. Absolutely. <laughs> Let's acknowledge the chat for a quick spell. Luna says too many mods in Jeep's house. There's just there's just two of them, but I guess that can't be too too many. Luna loves sushi as well. Hi, Chia God, welcome. Uh, Fig <laughs> says you love tomatoes, Usu. Bullshit. Bullshit. Sumio says tomato allergy. He's curious about that. Luna says it's interesting. Put it in the lore. Fig says she can't have raw tomatoes. She loves cooked tomatoes. Is that true? I can have cooked tomatoes, but they're not extremely my favorite. Yes. Ah, okay. Well, like like oh, yeah. pizza sauce and and I okay. don't really like ketchup. <laughs> okay, I got gotcha. you. Pizza sauce. Well, that's good. Well, that's good. See, folks. So Usu is a lover of foods. It was just a, a tomato kind of hazard uh, to the to this lovely bat's health. So keep them away from her. She's not a fruit bat because tomatoes are fruits. She's not purely a fruit bat. Gosh, was Fig making fun of that too? Now I'm thinking about him calling you a fruit bat. Jeez. No, I am a fruit bat. Oh, damn. Okay, okay. Well, okay, my guess correct. <laughs> All right, this is a fruit bat. Fruit, fruit bat, <laughs> fruit bat demon is is the terms you're looking for. Okay, fruit bat demon, got it. Okay, let's see. Okami says, but you actually fish the sushi. Huh? I'm sorry, I don't understand that can one. Can I fish? I can fish. Usu versus the Killer Tomato stream win. Oh yes! Oh, I love that movie. That movie is amazing. Killer Tomatoes. Oh, I've never actually seen it. Attack of the Killer Tomatoes. It's wonderful. Ah, <laughs> uh, fig. Wow. He says Usuki is a real fox. A bat. <laughs> Keep it in your pants. Keep it in your void blanket. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you hear that, folks? Sushi. I love sushi. Uh, that, 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 uh, I think my favorite currently, she is a fox bat. Oh, okay, okay, gotcha, gotcha. Sure, sure, sure. Mm hmm I, 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 I can read between the lines. Sumo says usushi. <laughs> um, <laughs> I, I, I think I was gonna say, the, my favorite currently, of um, like, not, not the really expensive kind, right? Because otherwise I love Otoro, which is the fatty tuna. But, uh, otherwise I like Hamachi, which is, I, I believe, Yellowtail. That one is mm -hmm. really fantastic. You know, kind of the white-looking one. Uh, very kind of fatty flavor. I like the fatty flavor sushi. That stuff tastes real, real fantastic. Yeah. S salmon and tuna, all, all of them are really great. Yes. Salmon and tuna. I said uh, unagi. What else does they have? Do you like, uh, you like tamago? You know, the egg sushi. Yes. Yes. Yeah. The orange eggs? Yes. Yeah. Oh, no, no. That, that, that's... Uh... You gotta get the really big, thick ones, too. Not yeah. the Not the tiny ones. Yeah, 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 yeah. The big poppy eggs. Yes. <laughs> the, yeah, Ikura. That's called Ikura. 
Um, so yeah, no, 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 nice sushi lover, delightful. I can mm. relate to one of my guests on food one of these for once. <laughs> okay. Um, oh yeah, okay. So for our viewers who don't know, but we have a lot of familiar faces, what inspired the the design for your VTuber model? If I ask. Um. So the inspiration behind my design was basically I love bats and they are amazing. Um, and oh. back in the days of Gaia, uh, they had like demon tails and demon wings, and I was really fascinated with that. Okay. And so it, Gaia actually inspired this design a long time ago. Gaia, I'm not familiar I've with Gaia. I've had this design since I was a little, 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 tiny, teeny, tiny bat. No way. Yep. So, so your model again, like comes from your childhood, like me. <laughs> That's uh -huh. too cool. Gaia. Okay, Gaia Online. Do you want to explain to me Gaia Online? Like how like are these like regular creatures in it or was so, it a character or So Gaia Online used to be like a a kind of an AOL chat room with characters that you could buy and uh create. And so I, I created mine. And mine got hacked and pillaged last September and she oh. no longer exists. Oh damn, that sucks. Fucking yeah, so hackers. I no longer have Usuki on on my Gaia account. Okay. Uh, well, let's get after the chat for Usuki on the Gaia account. Come on, come on, folks. Let's have it right now. May she... <laughs> R.I.P. Yep, rip, rip. May she rest in peace, folks. Come on, let me see it. Let's see it. Come on. I still have art of her, though, which is pretty cool. Yeah, it's like a memorial picture, though, you know, <laughs> at this point. Yeah. In memoriam, in remembrance of the dearly departed Usuki from the Gaia online server due to fucking no-balled hackers. Such is life. Which is fine. I was never going to get on that site anymore anyway, but she now lives in the, in, <laughs> she lives on in Right? Yes. Exactly, Luna. <laughs> She's right here and it's awesome. Okay, so that's where it came. That's too cool. So design as a kid, made into Gaia Online, and then Gaia Online's customization turned into this. What we see before us. Uh-huh. Delightful. Exactly. It is a very lovely model, by the way. I love the wings and just the color combo of the black and the, the turquoise kind of blue. It's very lovely. Thank you. I, I did make it myself. Um, nobody helped me create this. What? Yeah. No, no help whatsoever. Hey, another well, self-made uh, Except YouTube. for Mori. <laughs> Mori gave me the skin because the original skin it came with looked like crap. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, let's get... Uh, so, shout out to Mori. Shout out to Mori. Everybody should listen to Mori. Yes, the glasses are, are, are beautiful. I like them too. They're a very nice touch, actually. Um, Those took me a while to make. <laughs> uh, sorry, Fig. I still don't have that. I still don't have that shout out working. <laughs> I, I'm expecting a damage jeep any moment now. But um, yes, no, it's a very lovely model, and I'm surprised you did it all on your own. But not that surprised. But no, fantastic job, Usu. Well done. I gotta say. Yeah. Thank you. So, and you rigged the tail too, because that's I know that's like relatively new. Yeah, I rigged the tail as well. That one took me many, many tries to figure out. Wow. Folks, can you get a good look? You can see your tail moving, right? You can see that right behind us. And it's not too obscured by the couch, right? Look at that. Check it out. <laughs> look at that. Nice. Yeah, I can move a little bit for you. Yeah. Yep. Move the hips. Hip the tail out. Hip and whip. Hip and whip. <laughs> hip and whip. Hip and whip. It definitely whips. And it whips on its own, too. Nice. So it's kind of like a, a horse. You want you don't want to be on your backside. <laughs> no. Delightful. All right. So there you have it, folks. Self-made VTuber yet again with some help from the mighty Mori. Thank you, Okami David, for the shout-out to Mori. Sumio says, um, where is your tail, Jeep? I never had a tail, okay? The closest I think I have to my tail is... need to get you is... one. Well, I, I... <laughs> oh, that would actually be kind of cool, actually, a tail. Hmm. I'll think about it. I'll think about it, for reals. You need, you need a red one. Yes, I do need a red tail. It will be, it will, yes, nice, nice, nice eye for color, Usu. Yes, a red tail would be delightful. Exactly, Chia, tail of a tail. By the way, Sumio, what, what is that face? Oh, it's a what face. Okay, that's what that was. <laughs> All right, um, oh, okay, so since becoming a VTuber, uh, we don't know Okami. We don't know when. Maybe when I do my official 2.0 model reveal. But let's get on to the question I like asking. Since becoming a VTuber, mm -hmm. Usu, you're familiar with this one. What has been the hardest and easiest thing and that surprised you? Uh, the hardest thing is dealing with sound. Sound. Honestly. Sound. Like I, 
every time I, I get on, I'm like, is it working? Is it too loud? Is it too soft? I, I, I don't under, sometimes it doesn't come through my headset. Sometimes Ooh. it doesn't come through the computer. I'm like, I, I don't understand why it doesn't work. Plus I'm partially deaf, so that doesn't help. Yeah, that's true. Wait, is that bad or is that for real? That is for real. Oh, shoot. Okay, yeah, that really sucks. Sorry to hear that. Damn. Rough. Yeah, I mean, I'm mostly blind as well, so you've got that going for me. Wait, wait, wait. Is that, is that another joke? Or... <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I, I, I... No, that's true as well. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Now, okay, now I'm... I am a, I'm a true bat. I am literally a true bat. Wow, that, that's too perfect for your design then. And now I even understand even more how you can stand Fig. It makes all of us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't have to look at him or hear him. Yeah. <laughs> Love you. She loves you, Fig. You must feel pretty good, though. Let's put it that way. I hope your your, your touch is yeah, numb. Yeah. yeah, there you go. There you go. Fig feels nice confirmed. <laughs> and then what, what was the other part of that, that question? Oh, what was the easiest? That, that surprised you. Um, easiest was actually making friends. Like, I, I didn't expect anybody to watch me, honestly. Really? So that's been that's been a really nice surprise. Yeah, I know. It's it's pretty nice, this community, honestly, as long as you watch the VTuber a little bit and reach out to them. It's been very delightful. Love you, Okami. <laughs> yeah. Luna. Fig doesn't take enough pills to be abused like this. Well, you gotta start taking more, <laughs> Fig. When your wife's on the show, you, you gotta be, you gotta, you gotta take double doses. Come on, you're a void creature. You can do it, my man. Come on. Mm -hmm. Just, just grow some extra ribbons and take it. <laughs> just remember to swallow. Oh. <laughs> yeah. No. Um. Making friends, actually, in the VTuber world has been very fun and very delightful. I'm very glad with the circle we have so far. I, I'm like, you know, Luna, Sumio, Starstruck in general. It's been yeah, very it's fun. really good people. Yes, and Fig. Yes, Fig. This is not abuse. I'm serious about this. I love having you here. And I love having you in the circle as well, Usu. Always a delight. Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah. Well, I wouldn't have you on the show if I thought you were a piece of crap, so. <laughs> oh, of course not. Unless, you know, you're here to make fun of me. Are you here to make fun of me, Jeep? Uh, 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 may, m m sometimes in my head. Um, but, okay. I've been, I, okay. Uh, um, hold on. Hold on a second. I, I, uh, I think I soiled my soilables. Give me a second. <laughs> Give me a second, folks. Give me a second. I gotta change. Do -do -do. <laughs> All right, all changed, and I washed my hands. So, everything's good. We don't have to worry. Yay. Yes. Ooh, this was quite intimidating. Nice. I like it. I like being scared. I don't like soiling myself, but I like being scared. It's it's a bad combo. <laughs> Thank you for providing both pain and pleasure for me, Una, uh, Usu. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no problem. <laughs> I saw that face. I saw the face. <laughs> I can see it. These gl these glasses don't make me entirely blind. You didn't, you didn't see nothing. You didn't see a thing. I saw it. I saw it. I'm biting back. I saw it. I'm squinting, but you can't tell because these glasses are too damn big. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on a second. Hold on a second. I don't know what I can do. I don't use my facial movements enough. So let's see here. Yeah. 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 See? See that? Yeah. I, I see what you're doing there. I saw what you did. There, yeah. there you go. Yeah, I saw it. I saw it. Yeah. I saw it. I saw it. You, you saw it? Yeah, you think you messed with me? Yeah, I saw that. Check my eyebrows. I see everything. Look at this. Look, 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 look. look they're, they're wiggling like little caterpillars on my fucking head. Oh, I'm looking. Yeah. I'm looking hard. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking harder. Yeah. yeah, I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. Yeah, oh yeah, they're dancing all right. They're dancing. And now now I'm sad because now my head hurts. Ow. Ow, that's why yeah. I don't use these there. enough. I can. Ow. I got I got too sad for you too. Oh, thank you. Let's be sad together. Yeah. Misery loves company. Yeah. 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 We're, we're a couple of misbos here. So, you know, give us some pity. I want I want I want to have uh, Mr. Lobet. Yeah, pity's in the chat. Luna's saying there's brow action. Phil fix <laughs> says, "Oh god, turn those off." Ha ha ha. Anytime Fig is upset, <laughs> I can smile again. Let's smile again. Fig is unhappy. Okay, let's move on. There we go. We're getting my smile. <laughs> yeah, that's really cute by the way. That's really adorable. <laughs> that's adorable. <laughs> Um, okay, so what inspired the name Usuki, if that's, um, okay to figure out? 
Um, yeah, so the name Usuki actually came from Chavix. It's like it's it's spelled a little bit differently. So oh. if you've ever seen the anime uh, Chavix, there is Chab- a. Wait, wait, um, about, I talk about Chavix. Uh, clamp. Yeah. The clamp. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yes. By clamp. Yes, I, I've heard of it. I, so, haven't, I haven't read the manga. My, the B and I always like to read the manga before the anime. So, but go on. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so Yusuki is the maid of one of the the main characters. Okay. Um, and she is a computer. Ah. And I just I loved her design and I liked her name and I stole it, but it's spelled differently. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, that's clever. So wait, have I been mispronouncing it? Is it Yusuki, not Usu? It's it's Usuki. Okay, it is Usuki. Usu. Key. All right, folks. Got confirmation. It is Usuki, but it comes from Yus- uh, Yusuki, right? Is that what you uh, said? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Nice. It, it comes from it comes from from Isuki. but how Isuki. they pronounced it in the American, how they pronounced it in the American version, it was y- Yusuki. Okay, Yusuki. Got it. Yeah. Bits and Chia God is a fan. And apparently Luna says, come mm-hmm. to G's Variety Show for the sadness. Yes, yes. You will, you, you'll, you'll come happy and you'll leave sad. It's, it's the best way. It's the... <laughs> nice. Okay, so that's where the name comes from. That's too cool. Chobits. I'm glad I actually knew the reference to uh, someone's name for once. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Okami says, but in the Murica, but in the Mur- uh, Murica version. In the Murica. In the Mur- Murica. Murica. Murica version. I get it. I get it. <laughs> the Murica. Murica. All right. Um, oh, okay. So, any particularly great stream that stands out as like your favorite that you've done thus far, and and why? Uh, the actually one of my Pokemon streams. Yeah. Um, Tell me I'm why. doing I'm doing a po- Pokemon Nuzlocke, and there was one stream where I spent four hours grinding my team up for them to all just die. What? And then we started over again, and I haven't died since. Oh my god. <laughs> 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 what, what are you a glutton for punishment girl what the hell uh, yes you should see all the rules on that on those streams it's insane <laughs> oh dear me yeah, okami remembers it okami remembers it oh. was it was great it was one of the best streams i ever did <laughs> everyone dies okami says i don't, I don't want to zoom back oh <laughs> uh. The memories I'm are coming go hide back. Now. I'm just gonna, just gonna go hide. All right, all right. I'll hide her. Hold on. She needs to I hide. Can't hide. I can't. Go. You're I hiding. Can't hide. There we go. She's hiding now. She's gone. She's <laughs> she's flown the coop, folks. She's flown the coop in a bat in a very bat style. Okay, we need to get the bat signal up and running to get her back here. Okay. Um, is there anybody in the chat named Gordon, or anyone who wants to pass for a Gordon? Ah, fuck it. I'll be uh, Gordon. I'm I'm, com- I'm coming back. I'm coming back. All right. I'm all coming right. back. All right. There she is. I'm I'm sorry, I think I don't have sushi on me at the, at the studio. Uh, I wish I did. Welcome back, Usu. You all better now? Yeah, yeah, no. Um, so I didn't, I didn't, I caught a Zubat and I was like, oh, I don't want this stupid thing. I hate Zubat. And then it evolved into a Crobat and it saved my life. <laughs> okay, well, the bats are on your side, <laughs> I guess. Yeah. Even when you, even when you, even when you shit talk them. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Bats unite. Bats united. The bat uprising. It's coming, people. Be wait. Just wait for it. Um, I hope there's a bat uprising. That'd be so cool. You know, Lotto recently did a presentation on bats uh, on Sunday, talking about how they uh, help out the environment and whatnot, and their the importance of bats. Good old battery. Oh, yeah. No, they're extremely important. Yeah, it was very fun to watch. I like it. Lotto's awesome, though. Um. That's another guest, folks, for those of you who don't know. Lotto and Persephone, they're, they are wife and wife. Kind of like how Fig are wife and wife. I mean, husband and wife. Anyway, um, let's see here. Um, uh, okay, let's wrap up with this one. A game. What's a video game you've been looking forward to playing but never got around to? Could be years, days, or months. The number one game you want to oh, play. Oh, gosh. Number one game I would want to play. Yes. Um, I actually had it. Oh, let me think because I've, I've got it in my thing and I just haven't played it because I really want to, but mm-hmm. I'm busy with everything else. Um, tra- uh, trans transit transistor. Yeah. Transistor. Transistor. I've heard of that one. Why, why are you looking forward to playing that one? You like the trailers, the concept, what have you heard? What's up? I like the art. 
Oh, okay. The art to it is very gorgeous. And that that's what really draws me to a lot of games is the art. Okay, the art of transistor. I've heard of it, I haven't really seen anything about it. The B is more into looking up what happens in the game world. So he told me about that one. He said that one was actually pretty good from what he read. Yeah, yeah. I I watched somebody play it and they only played like the first hour of it and I was just like, "Oh my god, it's so pretty and so cool and I just I want to play it." I know that you you have a sword and you're like a hacker almost. Mhm. Mm and that's about it. <laughs> oh, good. You're going to be in for a lot of surprises then. Oh, that's that's going to be fun. I hope the game really works yeah. out for you. I hope you get around to playing that. I, I hope so, too. You heard that, folks? Transistor. Look forward to that one. The art, evidently, is beautiful. So take Usu's word for it. She may be a little bit blind as a bat, but I take whatever vision she does have could discern accurately. <laughs> Accuracy. Yes, yes. So let's see what this, this acknowledges the chat before we move on to our next corner, which will be the Pokemon game. Let's see. Fig says me, I mean, if I got to be a cute anime woman, I'd be okay with being wife and wife. Fig, you'll be many things. Cute is probably not one of them, but okay. You can be a sexy uh, uh, anime wife. That, that I can think you could totally pull off sexy. Fig also says, Usu, I'm really busy with everything else. That's a heckin' lie. Is it now? <laughs> Luna <It's> says, not. <laughs> <laughs> it is not. I, I have to trust my guest, Fig. I mean, you were a former guest. This is the present guest. Present guest takes precedence over formers. Sorry. Um, let's see here. Luna says, Modbot mentioned Transistor. Fig says, cute or no deal. Luna says, he's cute in a dead horse kind of way. Oh, okay, I, I, I'll, I'll give him that. Yeah, dead horses can be cute if they're Fig. He's, he's got ribbons. It makes him cute. Okay, you're right, you're right. I was just being jeep and bitter. It's my usual banter with Fig. <laughs> I've been ousted. Very well. Fig, you're cute. Okay. Fig says, I know what to do. I know what you do in your free time, Usu. Ah, I see. Don't share it with us here, Fig. Keep that as ambiguous as you like for everybody to use their imaginations as we get ready to move on to our next corner, which will be going to take a quick standby screen, and we'll be back in about three minutes. And I'll explain to Usu everything and so on and so forth. You ready, Usu, for some Pokemon? Oh, yeah. All right. Bring it. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Okay, we shall return in three minutes, folks. Three minutes. Very short. Very short interlude. All right, I will mute us.
There we go. We're back, folks. Like I said, it was a very short intermission. Good night, Luna. Have a good one, all right? Thank you for stopping by. Always a pleasure to see the Luna Meister in the chat. That's... Where the fuck is it? Uh, there it is. Okay. Pokemon time. And as you can see, I made now the chat widescreen so you'll be able to see your name better and what you're saying better. All right. There we go. Time to hang. Time to pull an Usu here and hang from the ceiling. All right. Do you hang from the ceiling? The ceiling's a fun place to be. Yes. All the time. Awesome. Yes, it is delightful. I mean, the blood rushing to the head is kind of a buzz, so I like it. It, it helps me go to sleep. Ah, uh, that's a good That's a good way to look at it. All right. We're sending Luna off with many farewells. Take care, Luna. Take care. Rest up, space cadet. Space cowgirl. Okay. Folks, many of you here know exactly how the Pokemon game works. Here's the difference, though. Okay, so Usu is going to get going up against you, the chat. So, Sumio, trying to get your Pokemon knowledge goggles on and your hat on, but Fig is not going against Usu. Remember these? Remember this? The chat powers? Well, now they are the Husbando powers, meaning Fig gets to mess with all y'all. And only he gets to choose which one to do, so there's no need to start any polls or anything. Fig has the power to to ruin everyone's time here. So when I prompt this, <laughs> so there you go. Best of luck, chat. Remember, she is Fig's wife. So I'm kind of um I'm kind of skewing this a little bit. <laughs> Jacking it against me. <laughs> uh, Fig says, "So Usu, how much you love me?" What would uh, you a lot, and you know that. You heard that, Fig. You celebrated her. And I let you get away with that, too. <laughs> but she was definitely worth celebrating. Okay, folks. Time to start the game. Let me pick a Pokemon. We're sticking with just Gen 1. Now, Usu, I believe, is a Pokemon master in her own right. So you're all going to have your your work cut out for you. Yeah, I, yeah. Well, we're going to try. I always have a choice, Fig. Come on. I always have a choice. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's start off with a nice, simple Pokemon. All right, I got the Pokemon all ready to go. And uh, let's roll the die. Usu will be odds. Chat will be evens. Boom. Come on. All right, Usu goes first. Usu? All right. Would you like to use an assist power? Um... First, first letter. Oops, she's going right into the for an assist power. Nice. Oh wait, um, first letter only works if um there are already letters on the board, and I confirm whether or not. Oh, oh, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, so gotta go with a different um, one. Right then now. I'll wait. I'll wait. Uh, okay, she's gonna wait. Let's roll the, the die. Oh damn, I always forget to bring up what each roll of the die means. Scuff on the jeep end. My mistake. Fuck you, whoever hates me for doing this. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, there we go. Got the rules up. Let's. Uh, oh, I don't. I don't need this right now. Don't need you right now. That comes later. All right, let's roll. Trivia die shows a three, and three is okay. It's gonna be name three Pokemon with this letter. All right, name me three Pokemon with the letter. Uh, with this, with the following letter in its name, but not starting with it. The letter oh, and uh, three Pokemon from Gen One. And I'm going to give you 10 seconds for this. Nice, solid 10. All right. The letter C. Go. Uh, Togetic? Oh, wait. Togetic. That's not Gen 1. Oh, crap. <laughs> um, no. Uh, can't start with it. Uh, 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 I gave you 15 seconds. I gave you 15 seconds. I'm sorry. <laughs> that's time. <laughs> C. What? <laughs> uh, well, there's, uh, there's Arcanine, Aerodactyl, um, now I'm forgetting a third one. Tentacruel. There we go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, Usu failed to do that one, so the chat gets a letter, but before that happens, Usu, would you like to solve the Pokemon? <laughs> no. 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 All right, let's add a letter, and the letter I will be adding is... N. All right, chat. Assist power or not? And remember, Fig, you're not part of the chat. You get husbando powers. I need a I need a majority. Who's playing with me tonight? 
Tia, we got Tia talking, we got Okami in the chat. I don't see a Sumio, it looks like he's dead. Or he's, uh, he's hibernating or some shit. So, okay, we got two no's. Alright, so it's gonna be Okami and Chia against you. Alright, then we can't have a majority. It has to be both, it has to be, uh, unanimous. Alright. Let's roll. Let's go. A three! Oh, <laughs> you're gonna have to add name three Pokemon letter in the name again. Sumio kind of sleeping right now. Ah, okay, yeah, he's probably, like I said, he's passed out, he's hibernating. He's, uh, he's waiting to deliver those gifts or just slacking off again. His usual shtick. Um, all right, chat, I am going to give you the same 15 seconds that I gave to Usu, and I want you to name me three Pokemon. Uh-oh, Sumio's back. He's back. He was eating dinner. Oh, okay. <laughs> anyway, okay, well, now that Sumio's back, we can have a majority, uh, majority vote. So... Here's what I gotta do, though. Since there are three of you, I want each of you to name a different Pokemon, and you can't cross Pokemon. If any of you mistakenly make a name the same Pokemon, you lose. Um, so I need three Pokemon with this letter in its name. I need three Pokemon, and you're only gonna get six... Uh, no, no, no. Um, seven seconds. I need three Pokemon with the letter... This letter in its name, but not starting with it. Give me three Pokemon with the letter U. Go. All right, I ended up giving you 11 seconds, and Sumio's the only one guessing. I said one from each of you. You failed that one! You suck! <laughs> he guessed twice. I gave you 15 seconds for that one. <laughs> and with that, you don't get a letter either. Ooh, do you want... Hey, chat, do you want to solve the Pokemon? <laughs> <laughs> with only one letter. Yes, with one letter. Chia says no. We need one more negative. If we get a yes, and uh, come on, ask me majority rules. Okami, do you wish to solve the Pokemon? You are the Pokemon Master Sumio. That's not the same as solving the Pokemon. Yes, they are counting on Sumio. This is essentially Usu versus Sumio. Hey, I got uh, yeah. I don't even play. <laughs> I don't even play that shit. <laughs> hey, you know what? I have an idea. No, never mind. Yeah, you know what? Let's have Sumio be your opponent right now until he has to leave. It's Sumio. Nah, you yeah, know what? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sumio's going to be... Work. Yeah, we're going to have Sumio in chat as the opponent. So, unless, Sumio, you want to jump in the voice chat and then you're just like in a, a disembodied voice. <laughs> you good with that, Usu? Uh, I'm okay with that. Yeah. Sumio, you, uh, you want to flex your Pokemon knowledge against Usu? Redeem yourself after you lost against... Oh, no. No, no. Seth lost to you. <laughs> Give me the answer, Sumio. We can't forestall this game for very long. We are on a schedule. Actually, we're not really on a schedule. This is a day off for Usu, so <laughs> we got lots of time. I know, I'm kind of putting you in the hot seat there. If you want to remain in chat, that's cool too, my man. Don't worry about it. I I'm just I'm just asking. Because poor Chia and Okami are kind of at a disadvantage. Usu is, like I said, somewhat of a Pokemon master herself. Somewhat of a Pokemon master could not name one single Pokemon for Gen 1. <laughs> Don't make me look like an idiot, okay? I can do that all by myself. You gotta make me look good, Usu. You gotta make me look good. She knows her Pokemon. She's not good at tests. Sumio says, okay, okay, wait. What do I gotta guess? Huh? I I'm... I'm just asking if you want to join the voice chat. You don't have to start off yeah, a model. Yeah, if you, you want to get in chat. Yeah, voice chat, um, in the guest voice chat that we have over here. That That's all I'm asking, Sumi. I'm not asking you to um, guess anything or rig up your model. Just be on Discord. Oh, okay, you can't at the moment. Cool. All right, then, Sumi, then it is Usu versus chat. All right, I'm going to assume you do not want to uh, solve the Pokemon. Oh, of course, 5 a.m. with family. Got it. Okay, chat. <laughs> I'm going to just skip you. You're not going to solve the Pokemon. I'm going to add another letter, and the letter I will add right now is... J. Very interesting letter to add. Ooh. Usu, do you want to use an assist power? You can even solve the Pokemon right now for extra points if you want to go for it. But, uh, do you? Um. What has an N and a J? Ah! No, no, uh, no assist power. Let's, uh, let's. Let's, let's roll. Go on. Alright, let's yeah. roll. Four! What do we have for four? By the way, can you, you all can hear that Pokemon right when it rolls. 
you can hear that, right? When I roll the die, this would be a Pokemon sound effect. Oh, delightful. Delightful. Just making sure. Alright. So, whoops. That's the wrong thing to get rid of. So, what is four? Ah, guess that Pokemon! This is usually the easy one. Boom. Alrighty. Let's do it. Guess that Pokemon. Which means I'm not going to give much... Let's see. Okay, who do I want to put in behind this? And Uso, I'm only going to give you f five seconds because you probably know them all just by what they look like. So, yeah. Here we go. I found the Pokemon. All right, here we go. Uso can see behind the ball. No, she can't. Shut up, Fig. I can't see behind she, the ball. She can't but see behind the enormous ball, dude. Come on. All right. Uh, Got to increase the size of dead Pokemon. All right. There it is. All right, here we go. Are you gonna appear? Okay, go. Uh oh, uh, Kingler. Damn it! <laughs> nice work. <laughs> yes, yes, that was King. I thought I could make it look like Krabby, but she knew it was Kingler. Shit. <laughs> um, you are watching the screen. Yeah, if you had if you had showed his other claw. It would have been a guessing game. Yep. Okay. Well, with that, you do get a point. So, did, were you able to... Uh, you are watching the screen I'm sharing with you, right? Because it's only a one-second delay on there. Yeah. Okay, good. All right, let's get... Usu gets a point for getting that one correctly. Boom. She has one point, And she gets a letter. And the letter I will add now is... Well, I think she's going to get it with no matter which letter I add. So, let's just add a... a, a there we go. Usu, would you like to solve the Pokemon? Uh, oh, 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 it's time, it's time, before you get to do that, dun 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 dun, husbando power, since Usu already has a point, oh. Fig, do you want to sabotage her, do you want to help her, it is your decision, my friend. Oh, no, that's not it. <laughs> Fig is helping, he chose add a letter, I'm sorry, chat, you are at a disadvantage here. Here's the letter I am adding. Rear, rear, rear. Every letter is present. Every letter is present. Oh. So you just have to solve the Pokemon. I will give you 30 seconds starting now. Jinx. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Jinx of the Pokemon with that. <laughs> with that addition, Fig helped Usu get the win. She now has three points. Chat has nada. I started with a relatively easy one, though. <laughs> I couldn't think of what had an N and a J in it, and then you put a Y, and it was like, wait, Pidgey? No, Pidgey? That's not it. It's not an N. And then it was like, X. Oh, Jinx. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's like, it's, it's Jinx. <laughs> Jinx, folks! Fig was thinking Jolteon. Oh, Chia knew it uh, after he saw the J. That was his guess. Oh, my goodness. Sumio! <laughs> Chia outdid you! All right, let's move on to the next first-gen Pokemon. Let's see. Ooh, I haven't done that Pokemon yet. Yeah, that's a good one. All right, since Usu went first that round, now we're going to go to chat to go first this round. Chat, would you like to use an assist power? Chia says no. We need uh, a unanimous because I'm not seeing Sumio. Two no's. Okay. Then we will not use an assist power. Let's roll the die. Boom, boom, boom. Five. What is five? Evolution Pokemon. Okay. I want Chia to give me a different answer and Okami to give me a, dis a, uh, a different answer. So you two have to hope you don't do this at the same time. You should probably watch each other's what you, you type. Okay. I will give you ten seconds for this since Okami doesn't play the game. Mm, excuse me. I had food. So I'll, I'll be burping from time to time periodically. Um... <laughs> I want I want one Pokemon from each of these evolutionary chains, just uh, one from each of them, and these are double evolutions. I want one Pokemon from Staryu's and one from Rhyhorn's. Go! <laughs> what the? Sturamite? <laughs> <Stur> <laughs> no, 
your time's <laughs> up, and I extended your time by like three seconds. No, it's it's, it's <laughs> oh my star, 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 star me. <laughs> oh my goodness. Star me. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the... oh, Tommy, you tried. Yes, and you were on the right track. Nice. Yes, no, Okami did try. That's, that's, why, that's why I thought it was brilliant. You were really close, Okami. So, for someone who doesn't play it, you knew you can't. You got like all the letters. Nicely done. Yep, yep. Indeed. Indeed. No, yeah, Okami, we're not laughing at you. Just seeing Starmie's name spelled that way cracks us up because we're Pokemon fans. <laughs> That's all it is, my friend. <laughs> okay, so with that, you don't get a letter. Do you want to solve the Pokemon? I'm just going to say you're not going to, and let's go to Usu. All right, Usu, you want to use an assist power? Did you did you want to put a letter up there for? Oh, thank you, thank you for the oh, thank you. Yes, yeah. yes, thank you. The letter I'm going to put up there is S. Okay. Now, would you like to use an assist power? Thank you, Usu. Gosh, I'm the host, and uh, the contestants are. So. Um, actually, I'm going to add a letter. Okay. Usu is adding a letter. Let's remove one of the APs, and let's also remove add a letter, as that is no longer available for this round. Okay, okay. The letter we are going to add to this shall be A. Okay. Ooh. Let's roll the die. Mm, five. Evolution Pokemon. Okay. I'm going to give you three separate evolutions, and I just want one Pokemon from each of those evolutions. That's all. So, name me one from Sandslash, Fearow, and Nidoking. Go. Sandshrew. Uh... Nido Ran. Male or female, uh, and then uh, heroes. Is oh, I gave Fero. you. I gave you twelve seconds. I'm sorry. That was the just at ran out of time. So. <laughs> like I couldn't think of what it was called. It's like why is Pidgey stuck in my head? No, Pidgey, it's Pidgey. Fero. Yeah, why is Pidgey stuck in your head? <laughs> I don't know. I guess. I guess. I guess there's something about them. Pidgey. It's just a Pidgey day. It is a Pidgey day. I, I'm refilling my my tea here, folks. So there's some pouring as an ASMR. And it is not my piss. God damn it, Sumio. Why'd you have to say that? <laughs> All right. So with that, you did not win the Pokemon the die roll. However, do you want to solve the Pokemon? Yes or no? No. Okay. And up, oh, up. Oh, here we go again. Husbondo power is back up. Now, Fig, it is chat's turn. What do you want to do? Let us wait his answer. Chat solve. Okay, Fig is gonna try and take it away from everybody. He's doing a bad one. Try and solve it, Fig. You're the one who has to solve it, not Chat themselves. Oh, Chat. <laughs> Fig says. I mean. That no, that's a good one. Fig chose Starmie. No, it is not Starmie. That is information for all of y'all. Okay, chat gets to go. Chat, would you like to use an assist power? Think. Think. <laughs> Fig says, you're welcome, chat. <laughs> Chia God wants to do choose roll. Um, Okami, you good with that one? What Chia said. Okay, Akami's going with that. They're, they're, they are in agreement. So, let's get rid of that. And we also need to get rid of NAP from the right side. Okay. Now, choose roll is simple enough. You get to choose the roll instead of it being random. Let me run through you the numbers again. One is guess the Pokemon name without using vowels. Two is Pokedex. Three is name, Pokemon, name three Pokemon with this letter. Four is guess that Pokemon, the Pokeball one. Five is evolution Pokemon. And six is reverse Pokemon name. Which one do you want? Uh, don't say the number, just tell me which uh, one. Do you want to guess that Pokemon with the Pokeball? That's usually the easiest one. Let us wait. There's always, of course, a stream delay. Yeah, okay. Chia's going with guess that Pokemon. Uh, uh, Okami's probably just going to agree. Alright, let's go with guess that Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, what Chia said indeed. <laughs> Alright, let's do guess that Pokemon. 
Let me see. Which Pokemon should I put behind this one? I'm going to give you a relatively easier Pokemon because, well, you're not like sniper eyes like Usu here. So, let's see. Who's relatively easy to figure out from behind the Pokeball? Uh, okay, that would be a funny one. Let's go with that one. Since I'm saying a funny one, any Pokemon thinker would know what I'm going with here. All right. <laughs> All right, chat. I am going to give you five seconds to guess it. And go ahead. <laughs> oh, sh okay. Okami knew that one. <laughs> yep. Yep. Yes. No, that's Okami. You got it right. That's the right one. Holy shit. Yeah, that's Voltorb. All right. Nice job. Okay. Well, with that, chat gets a point. And a letter. Where are the... There we go. So they got one point. Usu only had by two. And let's add a letter. The letter I am going to add to this now is... R. It really is starting to look like Starmie, isn't it? <laughs> Chat, would you like to solve the Pokemon? Way to go, Kami. Well, Chat? No. I saw the bump and I was like, fuck, it's... Fuck, it's not, it's not Voltorb. <laughs> no, but you got it. Okay, they're saying no. Let's go back to Usu. Usu, you have one more assist power left. Would you like to use one? No. No. All right, let's get on with it. Let's roll the die. Mm. Five. Evolution Pokemon. Oh. Again? Yes. It's, 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 this, okay. it's up to the die. This. Here we go again. Okay. I'm going to want you to name me three Pokemon again in this, in this evolutionary chain. And I will give you 15 seconds this time instead of 12. So you're going to have a lot. All right, the groups I want to hear the evolution from are Eevee, Ammonite, uh, Eevee, Ammonite, and Rapidash. Uh, um, does Umbreon count? <laughs> no. Jolteon, actually. Mm -hmm. um, and then Ponyta and, oh God, what was the third Pokemon? Ammonite. Ammonite, Amastar. Yep, you got it. She got it right at the very end. I might have—I don't know if I gave her too much time or not, but I definitely know I gave—I couldn't have given her more than two extra seconds. <laughs> Nicely done, Usu. And with that, Thanks. but yeah, you were—you were—you that was on the nose. Let's give her another point. <laughs> Usu gets another point and another letter. The letter we shall add now shall be. Uh, no. Oh, it's not what I was thinking. Oh, no. So, do you want to solve the Pokemon, or are you going to pass it? Uh, I'm, I'm going to try and solve. <gasps> Ooh, okay, she's going to try and take it away. Okay, go for it. What, is, what do you think it is? I think it's Omastar? Usu has guessed Omastar. Now, she knows it's not Starmie. Is it Omastar? I'm sorry, Yusu, it is not Omastar! So, gotta use that to your advantage, folks. And with that, chat's gonna get two letters instead of one. And the letters they are gonna get oh, are... Oh, I know what it is. U and O. Yep. Oh. <laughs> okay, and with that, ring a ling 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 chat, all the letters are indeed present. You, however, can use an assist power if you like. Do you want to use an assist power? Let me get that up and running for you. There we go. <laughs> I know what it is. <laughs> All the letters are present. I have to let you know that. And you, so you can use an assist power. You got one left, but you will have a timer to solve the Pokemon. You don't get infinite time for this because every letter is present. Assist power, yes or no? I want an answer quickly because I don't want you to have time to think what the Pokemon is. No, we have a no. No, okay, good. All right, you have 30 seconds to solve the Pokemon. Go. Who does? Chatter. Uh, chat does. Uh, Chia, yeah, Chia, Chia, yep, Chia got it. It's Tauros. <laughs> That's it. Tauros is the Pokemon. Yes, I know. Okami. Uh, did Okami just copy Chia? Or did you actually know this one, Okami? Way to go. They have closed the gap. Usu, your lead is in trouble. But they only get two points because there is no missing letters. Let's bring back the AP. Let's bring back all the assist powers. 
This is a one-point game. It's time to get on with the final Pokemon. <laughs> Don't worry, Okami. I'll keep you out of... Then why does it say three? Three? What the hell are you talking about? I, I said they're, they're, they're one Pokemon away. Or one point away. I don't understand, Fig. One point away from a tie. Yeah, one point away from a tie. That's what I meant to say. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's get the last Pokemon up here. And we'll do a full-fledged round. So, no no lightning round. Let's see. Ooh. Ooh, I like that one. Let's go with that one. All right. Usu goes first again. Usu, assist power, yes or no? Uh, no. All right. She's got the no. Let's go. All right. Let's roll that die. Let's roll. Let's roll. Let's roll. We got a three. Name three Pokemon with this letter. Oh, no. Oh. All right. I'm going to give you 15. Okay. I'm going to give you 15 seconds for this one. All right. Name me three Pokemon with this letter in the, in the name, not the first letter. The letter E. Go. Uh, Vaporeon, Jolteon, Flareon. <laughs> Okay, I thought that was a little too easy, but I decided to try. Yeah, she got him. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> okay. Uzu gets another point. <laughs> Nicely done. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> and let's give her a letter. The letter I am adding is... Ugh, come on. M. All right, Uzu. Would you like to solve the Pokemon? No. <laughs> nope. Yeah, of course not. <laughs> not off of one letter. And we're going to go, uh-oh, here we go again. During chat's turn, Husbando power has returned. Husbando has returned. Fig, what is your bidding? What is your will? And we will have it. Come on, my good ribbon-bearing creature of the void. Figs asks you a question, chat. How much do you love him? The void creature demands an answer. Usu has already expressed high love for him. <laughs> oh, oh, Kami David pulling out the emote. Enough to fill the void, Chia. Whoa, Chia, nice. Give point to. Oh, oh no, he he didn't. Oh, uh, hang on. Oh, fig. Oh, he's simping tonight. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I cannot believe it yet. I totally can't believe. Well, Usu, your man's working for you tonight. Right? <laughs> all right, let's get rid of the chat powers again. <laughs> Look at all the Usu love. All right, chat. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Do you want to use an assist power chat? You got to catch up. Fig is, is totally on Usu's side tonight. <laughs> oh my goodness. I wish Sumi was here so we can share in your pains for leaving you. Uh, poor Okami. <laughs> yes, I know. Poor Okami. Okay, they're saying no. All right, let's roll the die. Two. Pokedex. Okay. I need a correct answer from just one of you. Who's going to volunteer? I'm going to assume it's Chia God. Okay. Geodude is part of which set of numbers? 50, Ooh. 60, 50, 60 70, 80, 90. Go. Uh, Chia's going to go with 60. And you answered it within the time I gave you. I gave you 10 seconds, and you answered it right on the nose, actually. I didn't extend... I did not extend the timer. Is Geodude part of 60? No, Geodude is number 74. It was, he's in the 70s. Sorry, Chia God. That was so close. That was close. That was really close. That was a good guess. And with that, I'm assuming you don't want to solve the Pokemon. You know, fuck that. So let's go back to Usu and give another letter. Haha, <laughs> I remember this time. <laughs> All right. The letter I am going to add shall be the letter... A. All right, Usu, would you like to use an assist power? Uh, let me go ahead and mm -hmm. add a letter. Add a letter. That's a classic. Let's mm -hmm. do it. 
adding a letter. The letter I shall add will be um, another A. All right. Now, hold on one second. Got to I got I got to double check something here. <laughs> Cuz if if this Pokémon does if this Pokémon does not have two A's in it, I'm seriously fucking over this game. <laughs> Jeep can't spell. La 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 la. la. <laughs> Jeep can't spell. Yes, I, I I never learned in school how to spell. Okay, yeah, there's not two A's in this. I'm going <laughs> to Okay, okay. There, there, that's under... not the two Pokemon I was thinking of. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There is an E in the Pokemon name. There we go. I know that for certain. Okay. So there's the letter that we added. Okay. Let's roll the die. Six. The first time six. Reverse Pokemon name. Okay, Usu. You need to say this Pokemon. Um, this Pokemon's name in reverse. I'll give you the hint what Pokemon okay. it is. Then you gotta say it backwards. And you gotta say it correctly on the first try. So no, no flubbing it up. I'll give you a good fifteen seconds to to get it right. I want to hear okay. the first evolution of Golbat backwards. Go. Have. Og. Oh no no you misunderstood oh I, I explained it wrong I didn't um I, 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 I said I said I wanted to hear oh 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 yeah no I'm sorry no zaboos is that no tab tab taboos taboos yep no no taboos no but R.I.P. R.I.P. indeed no no you don't get that one no do you want to solve the Pokemon no all right. Let's take it back to the chat. Chat, do you want to use an assist power? You still have two available. This is the final round and your la and your chance to win. <sighs> Dang, I, I did the Zubat on purpose. I thought you were going to get that. <laughs> but, 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 no, I hate Zubat. <laughs> she is going with choose roll again. Do you agree, Kokami? Do you agree? What Tia said, I love it. Thank you, Okami. I love this so much. Good. Oh, this is so funny. <laughs> All right, one AP down. Okay, you want to go with the um, guess that Pokemon again? Wow, Tia remembered it was four. All right, let's get that Pokeball up. Boom. Let's see which Pokemon shall I choose to give uh, our wonderful Okami a fighting chance? Let's go with this one. Okay. I think we can see the Pokemon, like, within three seconds. So I'm going to give you all uh, seven seconds this time because, well, Okami got it pretty fast. So let's uh, let's get that going up. Oh, this is a small picture, this one. That's right. All right. Oh, I know what the problem is. <laughs> Jeep knows what the problem is. Jeep can't spell, but Jeep can see. There is nothing wrong with me. He, he, he. Okay, time enough for the crappy rhymes. What? That's Voltorb again! Oh, I know what happened. <laughs> okay, now we're better. Now we're better. <laughs> Damn it. No scuff. Can't do the scuff. Okay, come on. There we go. Okay, and go. <laughs> Pokemon, gotta catch them. It's you and me. I know it. Time's up. Sorry, chat. You didn't get it. Cloyster. That's right, Usu. Usu knows it. She just said <laughs> That's right. Cloyster. cloyster. It's Cloyster. Yeah. And actually, I would have accepted that, that spelling. You know, yeah, there you go. Cloyster. Wow, you even know how to spell it. Okami. Uh, are you a sleeper? Are you, are you, are you, are you, you know, you, are you trying to scam us here? Do you actually know Pokemon better than you put on? <laughs> ah, just couldn't remember the name. I see. Well, sorry. With that, you do not get another letter. Usu will when it is her turn. And, ooh, I forgot to give them a letter. That's okay. They can get this and try to solve it anyway. The letter I will give them is another E. All right, chat. Would you like to try and solve the Pokemon? No, don't worry, I'll comment. I take the, I take the delay into account. So that's why I, um, when I said seven seconds, I had to give you more like 12 or, or 10. 
Alright, Chia's gonna say no. And we're gonna pass it to Usu. And Usu's gonna get another letter because this is the letter that she missed on. Uh, I mean, that they missed on. Okay, so what letter shall I add now? Mm, let's add an N. Usu, would you like to use assist power or solve the Pokemon if you have an idea for a maximum point? Before we get to that, before we get to that, we are back to Husbando power. Now we're doing. No! Now we're here during Usu's turn. Fate can take and ruin everything if he wants to solve it. He'll take it away from Usu. What does he want to do? He can take points as give. He can remove a letter to make it even more annoying. Fig, you're in control again. What do you want to do, void creature? <laughs> what Tia said. Fig asks, how much do you I love, love you a lot. <laughs> Look at Usu's face. She got her game face on. <laughs> I love you a lot. Mm -hmm. And Fig chooses. Go oh, back to me. Letter remove. We are gonna get rid That's of a fine. letter. Let's see which letter. Sh which letter shall I get rid of? I am choosing to get rid of the letter. I'll get rid of E. He is against you right now. <laughs> I guess. <that. laughs> Look at that cute smile. It wasn't enough though. Let's see. All right, Usu. Back to you. Assist power. Solve. What you want? I'd like to solve. She's going for it. What is it? Charmillion. Oh. <laughs> Folks, let me tell you something. It's not Charmillion. It's not? No, it's not. And we're going to go back to chat with your attempt to solve and they get two more letters. No. Damn, that was a good one. Let's bring back the letter E. And I will add another one. The next letter I will add is I. Okay, chat. This is your chance. Do you want to use an assist power or solve the Pokemon? Solving the Pokemon will give you max points. You get two points in total for solving it correctly and one point for each missing letter. What do you want to do? No, you can't get ahead. There are still missing letters. You could, you could easily tie it. Okami's going for solve. Chia, do you want to solve with Okami? Oh, wait, Rune, let's, let's better their odds. Let's do it. Rune, look what's coming back. Look what's back before you get a chance to solve. Fig, do you still want to sabotage Usu's chances? Uh... Or do you want to help Usu? All right. Who loves Fig more, chat or Usu? How can they prove that to you, Fig? Do you request a quote? A sonnet? A poem? <laughs> I was about to say poem. <laughs> they, they, they literally cannot. I can. If I wasn't busy right now. <laughs> Oh, no solve penalty uh -oh. for ch for chat. Oh, my goodness. Fig, you backstabbing piece of... Okay. Yeah. All right. Okami and um, Chia solve away with um, no penalty. So you won't give an extra letter to Usu. She'll get one letter if you, miss, if you get it wrong because you're going for the solve. Give me a Pokemon name. First Pokemon name in the chat is the one that will be the one to solve. So you're probably going to rely on Chia. What have you got? Oh, Okami. Okami chooses yep. Magnemite. Yeah, it's Magnemite. And with that, yep. we get another G and a T. That's two letters right there and two for solving. Wait, is this a tie? It's a tie. It is a tie. All the letters are there for Magnemite. Magne. Oh, no, wait. I'm missing an M. No, they win. There are two oh, M's. Yeah. Yeah. There are two M's in Magnemite. Fig, you son of a bitch. <laughs> If you had stolen a point from them and given it, but that's it. Oh my goodness, chat beat Usu. All right, well done, chat. Congratulations, chat. Pachi, pachi, pachi. Pachi, pachi. Way to go, Okami. You know this is a good win for Okami though, because like you said, he, did, he doesn't know his Pokemon, so 
Magnemite! I, I'm getting I'm getting him to know his, his Pokemon. He's watching my Pokemon streams. He's good doing game. Good. good game, everyone. Nice job, Usu. Give it up for Usu for giving us a lovely time here and trying her best to sway the Figmeister. It just didn't work the way. Thank you, Usu. Look at that lovely bow she's giving. All right. And give it up for the chat, Okami, David, Tia, God, and fuck you, Sumio. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he abandoned them. He abandoned them. Let's not pretend he didn't. <laughs> he did. He he totally did. Totally ditched them, left them in the dust. <laughs> there ain't no way around it. I'm just trying to I'm trying to look for Magnemite to put it up on the on the screen here. Where is it? No, that was good. Wow. Like uh, so see I told you, um Okami David, last minute uh, last minute win. There's a little tiny little Magnemite right there. Magnemite! Woohoo! By one point! By one point! Wow. Alright, chat. It's time for us to take a little break. When we come back, it's PowerPoint edition this time, where I put on my sarcastic glasses. And Ooze is going to try and... It's probably going to beat me again. I mean, who the hell ever votes for me in those things? But, you know, whatever. All right. <laughs> Let's get to the standby screens. Again, we'll take another three to five minute break. We will be back. Well, Tamatoa hasn't always been Run you yourself, but if you must pretend You may meet your end Arm yourself, because no one else here will save you The odds will betray you And I will replace you you can't deny the prize, it may never fulfill you. It longs to kill you. Are you willing to die? The coldest blood runs to my veins. Try to hide your hand. Forget how to feel, forget how to feel. Life is gone with just a spin of the wheel. Just a spin of the wheel. Arm yourself because no one else here will save you. The odds will betray you. And I will replace you. You can't deny the prize, it may never fulfill you. It longs to kill you. Are you willing to die? The coldest blood runs through my veins. You know my name. You know my name. You know my name. You know my name. You know my name! You know my name! You know my name! Ah -dum, ah -dum, ah -dum. Jeep! Well, here we are again. It's always such a pleasure. Remember when you tried to kill me twice? Oh, how we laughed and laughed, except I wasn't laughing. Under the circumstances, I've been shockingly nice. You want your freedom, take it. That's what I'm counting on. I used to want you dead, but now I only want you gone. She was a lot like you. Maybe not quite as heavy, 
Now little Carolyn is in here too. Bum 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 bum. One day they woke me up so I could live forever. It's such a shame the same will never happen to you. You got your short sad life left. That's what I'm counting on. I'll let you get right to it. Now I only want you gone. Goodbye, my only friend. Oh, did you think I meant you? That would be funny if it weren't so sad. Well, you have been replaced. I don't need anyone now when I delete you. Maybe I'll stop feeling so bad. Go make some new disaster. That's what I'm counting on. You're someone else's problem. Now I only want you gone. Now I only want you gone. Now I only want you gone. We're back, people. We're back. And I, okay, I gotta stop hanging around. I gotta stop. I gotta stop pulling an usu here. I gotta pull a jeep and put plant my feet. Alright, boom, 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 boom. Alright, those of you familiar with this corner, <laughs> I'm pretty sure everyone here knows what this, what's going on here. So, yes, the trademark Jeep Flip indeed. Thank you very much, Chia God. It's time for us to put to the test who can present the better case for what they are representing. And today we are, okay, there we go, gotta get all of Usu's wonderful bat ears, because otherwise she won't be able to hear everything. She needs them. You know, she works with sonar. Ears help. Well, you need you actually need the the, the ears from so never mind. Um, <laughs> um, I, need the, I need the ears to hear. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. You need the ears to hear. Okay, folks. Fruit bats don't use sonar. Oh, they don't. Nope. Oh, and she's a fruit nope. bat. Damn it. I got I got a bone up on my bats. And don't take that as a as a crude thing, by the way. Okay. Um, let's begin today's contest of contests. Fire versus bulb via PowerPointishness. Here we go. <laughs> okay. I am on the side. Usu's on the side of candles. I on the side of light bulbs. <laughs> now, naturally, I always win the coin tosses backstage, except this time I didn't. And I think somebody cheated, but what the fuck ever. I'll listen to whatever the coins say. So, Usu, that means you get to go first. And you must tell us why <laughs> your your little fizzy wizzy candles cannot do my wonderful buzzy buzzy wuzzy wuzzy light bulbs. I don't think you stand a why chance. Why beautiful fire is so much better? No, it's not. I'm better. I'm better. All right. Fig says, "Chat, chat." I will have a poll up at the end. Yes, chat. You get to decide the very end who wins. Okay, they ha oh, I want to read chat one time. Fix says they have some sonar, but it's not as developed as their insect-eating cousins. Got it. Okay. Here's your first image. Oh, uh, Usu, look at the, the, the countdown uh, on the screen I'm sharing with you. Tell me what number you see as it counts down. 125, 124, 123, 122. Okay. 120. <laughs> Wait, one more time. 126, 125, 124, Okay, got it. Okay, so Usu, you are dealing with a three-second lag, so I'll keep that in mind with the timer. All right, here we go. Now I'm back in character. Here's your image, Usu. Boom. <laughs> oh, the B. Providing such oh, great comedy. Okay. <laughs> All right. You ready? Here's your countdown. Yeah. All right. Um, so camels camels here, they, they live in the desert, right? And you, when you think of the desert, you think of, of, of heat and fire. And what does what does fire provide? Light. And so, so that is vindicative of the the candle oh when you're out there on this camel right you're you're gonna get light because you're you're outside where the sun and the fireball is and that's that's the candle that's exactly it that's i 
a, a, a desert camel fire. Okay. So it's it's the desert. That's why. That's why it's better. Because you're, you're providing heat as well. You get heat from the fire when you're out in the desert on a camel. Um, and in, in conclusion, you're going to ride on this camel and get heat. That, I, I, I don't have anything else. <laughs> Thank you, B. Thank you for, for providing me with my beautiful camel to ride on. Yes, thank you indeed, B. We'll, we'll, we'll close the countdown right there. <laughs> All right, fine. I, I, it's, it's, it's the perfect argument. Whatever you say. I think I got this one in the bag, personally. You couldn't think more than ten words into that one, so... <laughs> nope. Well, if you could think of one of those ten words to take away, what would you apply to your candle? Uh, heat. Heat. Mm, okay, that's a, that's a good goal. That's on my side. Heat. Mm hmm. Okay. All right, I see that. I see what you did there. Very, very rookie mistake. Heat only has four letters. I'm going to use a bigger word than a four letter word. Bigger is better, and I am better. You're going to see how. Let's get mine up there. Let's see this Jeep own this shit. <laughs> First, I got to lubricate my throat. Okay, now I'm ready to own this shit. What do we got? What do we got? <laughs> Can't. What the fuck? We gotta... Okay. Fuck me. <laughs> fuck me. Okay. Alright, so, so, we, so we got ourselves we got ourselves some booze, some foaming booze, okay? Here's the thing, right? So, she brought up that there's heat in the desert, and you're providing more heat. That's gonna fucking kill ya! But beer? Oh, beer. When can't you go for a, a wonderful piece of foamy goodness that disappears in your mouth and dries you out and dehydrates you? But you want to see the foam. You don't want to not see it. And how do you see it? With a light bulb. Not by candlelight. Fire and alcohol. <laughs> Everyone dies. Light bulbs and alcohol. <laughs> everyone lives. And everyone gets drunk. And everyone fucks. And everyone's happy. So, in short, booze is better seen by electricity than candlelight. Candlelight can set a mood, but you just don't want to have that shit around open booze. So, with this beautiful pitcher, lager, I forget what the fuck they call these. It's booze, okay? It's beer. You like beer. Fuck the camel. Fuck the heat. You want to cool off? Drink the beer and have some meat. And do it by, 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 by light bulb light. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm the best. Okay, so with that, the one word I have to take away from this that is more than just a simple, measly, crumb, bummy four letters is booze. <laughs> booze. Light bulbs bring you booze. Booze. Come on. Heat or booze. What are you going to choose? Booze. All right, batty gal. Let's see you uh, fly and squeak your way out of this one. <laughs> I got this in the bag. Here's your image. <laughs> oh. There we go again. Okay. Countdown time. Uh, okay, so this this thing here needs um, probably is from space or some other worldly creature, probably from the void or from the darkness. And um, it needs to die, right? And so what do you have to kill it with? You you have your fire, right? And so you're holding on to your candle, trying to probably go through a cave or, you know, wherever, the desert. And so you're you're trying to go through this cave and, and or the desert and trying to kill this thing. And so you're just gonna throw the candle at it. And it, it'll kill it instantly with fire. If you throw if you throw a, a bulb at it, it'll just break and not do anything to it and so the the monster there will eat you and it, you're, you're not gonna be able to get away from it with a light bulb but with a candle with a candle you can throw the candle at it and it'll kill it 
and that will save your life. And so thus far, candles are way better than light bulbs because light bulbs will, you know, just break and shatter and be terrible. Choose, choose the candle, choose, choose the candle. That's my conclusion there. I see. Them's fighting words right there. What's your goddamn word? Get on with How do you explain this in one word? Your alien killing candles. Death. <laughs> <laughs> Understood. Death. Understood. Death. Oh my goodness. That, that, that is frightening. Huh. Oh, you're, you're, you're giving this to me. You're throwing the game. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, he, he, I, 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 that was an actual laugh. I wasn't coughing. That's just how I laugh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Ugh, same light bulb shatter. You know what? I'm going to shatter your soul with this. What the hell? Fine. Fine, B. A four <laughs> ball. A four. Okay. All right, so okay, so so we got a we got a pool ball. It's a four. Now, how the fuck does it relate to a light bulb, B? Okay, it's round like a light bulb. Okay, so who doesn't love playing pool? And remember the booze? Who doesn't like drinking and playing pool? And you know she brought up death. You don't want to die, okay, when you play pool. You know this is the number four, which is a number for death in Japan. But for us, it's just the number four, okay? Four player games are party games. This ball, the circle represents. I'm a circle. We are simpatico! And light bulbs are circular. There's simpatico in this happening everywhere. Uh, links and whatnot. And, and fun and games because it is a, a fucking pool ball. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw this at the bee when we're done. And um, so fun and games. And you can have your booze. And the candle. Well... candle will the wax candle will wither out before any light bulb will because pool games can last a fucking long time there you go so if you want to enjoy the game longer go with light bulbs if you want and also it's all circular and, and, and it's very symmetrical and very lovely you want a shorter pool game you lose all your lights you go with candles but who wants a, a short lifespan and that's it for my time so sounds like that one kind of messed you up yeah well i'm gonna mess you up because <laughs> I, I I have I have a Gatling gun. I, I stored somewhere. I'll find it. Um, okay, so if there's one word I have to take away from this shit, what's the one word? Um, that's better than death. I would have to say is right, where can I see it? Where can I see my goddamn word? B, your your pictures are too big. Okay, let me get my word back up there. All right, the word I use is longevity. Longevity. That's right. Booze, longevity, heat, and death. Hmm, which is scarier, getting drunk and living forever, or dying in the heat? Me, I'm not scarier. Oh wait, I asked what's scarier. God damn it. Okay, um, don't <laughs> scratch that last remark and just hate Usu. Just just send a lot of blame towards Usu. Okay, um, because I'm sexier. Uh, Usu don't. I've got boobs. I win. I I can grow boobs. I, if I as long as I gain some more weight, <laughs> I, I can have say I can have boobs. I can I I can. All right, Usu, let's try to get your picture. There we go. <laughs> Let's... Oh. There you go. You oh, count okay. down. Um, so, you know how we were speaking about being in the desert and uh, being in caves and things and fighting things? Well, you need a gun for that as well. And so you've got your candle and you've got your gun and you can see what you're doing. You don't have to be in a bar with with uh, your booze and, and your pool. You, you've got a weapon. You've got fire, and you you're fighting monsters, and you're gonna survive, and you can you can use the light bulbs as target practice. Uh, you can't use a candle as target practice; it it doesn't work that way. But you know, it 
it's it provides light and warmth and it's a weapon and so is this gun and so the you you have a a beautiful way to survive through whatever you need to survive through um and that is that is why candles are far superior to light bulbs because you can survive um so therefore guns guns equal your survival weapon and your survival weapon you also need your candle that's that's it that's my conclusion there wow i now i definitely want a gun and a candle you know the wax will burn my hand whatever whatever it's not like i win this shit anyway she does have the boobs okay i'll give her that i i'll have them <laughs> they're mine are in the mail they're coming in the mail all right Ooh, Sue, give us a word mm -hmm. for... Uh, the the word is uh, survival. Survival. Interesting contrast to death. Are you trying to fuck with us? Nope. Promise. All right. I'll trust you for now. Well, Chet, it's time for me to take home my gold medal. Let's bring on the next one. And it is. God damn it, B! That's gotta be the ugliest. Oh, that's disgusting! <laughs> oh my god, I'm so repulsed, I can't even think of what to say! Holy shit! That's like a gray bumblebee gargoyle motherfucker who's. who's like drunk as shit! Maybe he's a mosquito. Okay, alright, so okay, um. Alright, candles. Um, don't work as well as lights, light bulbs, because light bulbs are... He's stoned! Oh, thanks a lot, Fake. Oh, yeah, whatever the fuck ever. Fuck you, too. Um, okay. <laughs> the, the bulbs, they bring bugs. You know, you got, you got bug zappers. So you can't do that with fire, right? The, the, the fire chases them away. And you definitely want to zap this ugly-ass motherfucker right here, because he is scaring the shit out of me. I don't even see teeth, and he's using, like, a little to be a toothpick. And he's got four fingers, and... It's four limbs. He's not even a real fly. I think this is a motherfucker who's cosplaying. That's what I think this is what happened right here. Oh god, I'm saying it's too. Okay, so you get bug zappers with this, and fire just just gets gets the bugs, you know, in heat, right? See, because you got heat there and death and survival. This guy right here, he loves the heat. The flies love the death if he is a fucking fly. And survival, shit, they don't survive very long. So what encompasses the fly cannot apply to what my opponent is saying. However, booze and longevity, ignore those. Bottom line, he's a fly and like zappers. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right. Um, yeah. But what? <laughs> fly. <laughs> fly. Fly. Um, All right. If I think they burn better. If there is one word I want to take away from that fucking thing, it's... Fucked. There you go. That's the word. <laughs> so, and today's a little bit of a shortened one. So actually, that was the grand finale. So, Usu, your final words to wrap everything up, to present your case, and then I would present my winning case. Go ahead, future loser. Okay. So, my winning speech is, in conclusion. Candles are better because they provide heat. They can kill things, so they provide death. And you can survive with them because fire equals survivor, or survival, rather. So candles make you live more than a light bulb will. And that is it. Brevity. This woman's all about brevity. Probably because it starts with the letter B, like bat. Well, I think it's very clear. Who doesn't want to get drunk off their ass and enjoy seeing it and seeing the drunken madness? Who doesn't want to live forever with longevity? Death, heat, and survival? Give me a break. Light bulbs can provide heat. Light bulbs can provide death. You just gotta smell, you know, the mercury. And survival? Well... Okay, she got me on that one. But um, in the end, you got fucked, right? Okay? 
<laughs> with fucked. Who doesn't like getting fucked? I should have said fucking, but I'm going with fucked here. And you do it with light. Candlelight is more moody, but with lights on, oh, you get the best porn videos ever. That all comes from lighting, not from candles. So, you're, you're going to have a good fucked, but you're not fucked. Usu's fucked because uh, I got this. I got this in the bag. And with that is my closing statement: light bulbs are better than candles because you got booze, which leads to longevity, which leads to fucking or fucked. Uh, forget about everything Usu says. Just forget everything she says. Just forget her face. Okay, forget those cute glasses. Forget her voice, and just listen to my charming voice. All right, Fig, bring up the poll, but I don't think it's necessary, Usu. I'm sorry, but, you know, I am just far better at this than you. I'm more experienced, but, you know, to each their own, I guess. Yeah, I think I kind of have this one in the bag. Fuck you. <laughs> Can candles do kind of set the mood a little bit better than light bulbs. Yeah, but light bulbs are better for porn. Everybody loves porn. God damn it. Who's, okay, who's going for, hey, stop it. Stop it! I got money! I got money! I got booze! Why do I lose every single time? Is, it, is, there, is there no pity for me? I'm the only one who voted for myself! What the fuck is this? 9%, 1 vote to 10 votes. Oh, How many dicks and pussies do I have to lick and suck to get a win? Just just give me a number and I'll I'll, I'll see if I'll do it. Oh dear. Two votes! I got two votes. Someone else give me a vote. Oh, Jeep, you got two votes. Oh, do shut up. Somebody likes somebody likes light bulbs. Yeah. Somebody does. Oh, well, thanks for that though. But, yeah. 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 Oh, you're up to four, five, six? <gasps> yes! The Jeep comeback of the century is happening! Eight! Yes! Eight to seventeen! Yes! There's time left, folks! There's more than 50% left of the timer! Come on! Come on! Come on! Give Jeep the win! Give Jeep the win! 16 to 20! Holy crap! Who's sipping for me?! Eight! 20 to 23! I don't know! Oh! 20 to 28! Oh, god damn it! 20 to 34! No! 20 to 40! Oh, my goodness! Someone's really... Oh... 27 to 42. Oh, oh wow. Oh, 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 30 oh, to 42. Oh. 34 to 42. 34 to 42. Oh, 37 to 42. Yes. 39 to 43. Crap. The Usu, the Usu simping is back. 39, 44. Oh, 39, 50. Who? 50. 52, wow, 52. that jumped. What the hell? 44, 40, 55. 44, 56. Usu's wow. in the, is ahead. 46, 56. 49, 56. God damn it. 49-58. Usu, this is a close match. 49-60. Yes, yes. 54-60. Holy crap. 54-63. Am I going to win one for once? 54-64. 57-64. 58. <gasps> Come on. Oh my gosh, deep. Yes. Yes. All my pissing. The fire. All fire, my, you guys. All my lying and bullshit's finally going to pay off. Usu's clearly the superior contestant. Come on. <laughs> Hey, come on. Hello? Ding dong, ding dong. Ring a ling a ring long. 58 64. 58 64. Time's up. Where are my Jeep Simps? Sue me all! Hello? 59 64. 59 64. Ah! <laughs> so close, Jeep. Uh. Oh my god, family! <sighs> Congratulations! Wait, which one? Which one put the, did Big put that much in? Congratulations, Usu. You, good lord, you are the better bat by far. Give it up for Usu, people! Well done. That was good. I love the words you came up with: heat, death, and survival. Well done, Usu. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fig is not. I had to channel my inner Mori. Yes. Def oh, yeah, those all kind of represent more. Yes, that's, that's true right there. <laughs> <laughs> well done, folks. Well done. Um, Fig is not taking questions this time. I wonder, Fig, if you spent all the points on me just to get my hopes up, and then you just took it away from me. Am I on to something here? <laughs> all right, with that, Usu is our winner, of course. Well done, Usu.
Thank you, thank you. Oh, but it felt good how close it was. That was fun. That was neck and neck. I don't know if we have to take much of a break, Usu. You want to just jump right into Celebration Appreciation and talk about you know what? Uh, sure. All right. Let's go on to the next one, folks. This show's going to keep on rolling. Like I said, we have a jam-packed show. After this, we're going to be singing. So yep, yep. that'll be the grand finale. Let's go. All right. Deep can shrink down. Go around there. All right. Here we go. We all know the rules of Celebration Appreciation. Everyone here knows. I don't have to remind anybody. So let me just... Make sure her ears good. Make sure this is. There we go. Make it a little smaller. There we go. All right, folks. <clears throat> Everyone, celebration appreciation corner here is what is Usu celebrating? Well, if any of you caught the the tweets I made, you probably can guess right away. But if you can't, well, here it is. Pokemon. Just Pokemon in general. She didn't sing a lot of game. Just Pokemon. So I got this lovely image of like all the classic games and also the modern ones. Straight up Pokemon. Yep, straight up Pokemon. So there's her wing covering that one right there. So there's, I'm not gonna I'm, I'm gonna put it back over here though. Okay, Usu, tell us your love of Pokemon when you first discovered, it, fell in love with them and whatnot, and followed it all these years. Let's go for it. What you got? So, Pokemon first started for me uh, way back when I was a little kid. When I, you wake up early on Saturday mornings and it would be on TV, um, and then they started coming out with the card games and the games, and I got. Uh, yellow as my first game, even though red and blue came out first. You got yellow? I saw yellow and was like, oh my god, I get to be I get to be Ash. And so I played yellow and I realized that I couldn't get all of the Pokemon in that game. Ooh. So I bought the other two. <laughs> nice! You you have red, blue, and yellow, the classics? I have I have all of the games. All of them. Oh. Not just the ones you're showing on the screen. I have the ones for the GameCube. I've got the ones for the uh, N64. Um, I've, I've been playing Pokemon since the very beginning. I still have all of my original cards. Ooh. All your, all your original cards, too? Yes. You got, you got like that Charizard holofoil? Uh, probably. But I, I have um, a really weird card that's actually misspelled it's probably worth a lot of money and i'm never gonna get rid of it <gasps> nice oh my um yeah so I, I i love pokemon so much i've got stuffed animals i've got figurines Keep it's going. just my favorite game nice um any any, any like Real fond memories of any of the classics Pokemon? Let you like. Let's talk about. Let's run through the Pokemon games. You know, there's Pokemon Stadium, Pokemon Coliseum, Pokemon Snap. Uh, uh, let's go uh, that that Pikachu one. Um, any any the Hey You Pikachu? Yes, thank you. Hey You P Pikachu for the N64. Um, run us through some of those memories. You got some good ones to share with that? Um, I remember when I got my first shiny. Oh, which it game? It was actually in Pokemon Crystal. Crystal. Uh huh. So I was running through the grass, as everybody does, <laughs> and ran into this weird, weird colored Pokemon. Do I remember which one it is? No, because it was so long ago. But I still have the game, but I can't play it because it's actually corrupted, which sucks. Oh, I'm um, sorry to hear that. Yeah, but I remember running into this Pokemon, and I was like, oh my god, is it glitched? If it's, I'm going to catch it anyway. And I caught it, and it had this, you know, extra star on it. And I'm like, what does this mean? I don't know, understand. And I just caught another one that looked like it. Yeah, shiny Pokemon. First one. Woo! Never knew. Nice. It was really cool. Okay. I and then, of course, yes, go on. My, my favorite one, my favorite one is Umbreon. Umbreon, that's your favorite you, you Pokemon. Can't, you can't be an Umbreon. Nice. That is a nice Pokemon. I did not know that. It's and it's shiny. Yeah, it's shiny ver version has little blue circles. Really pretty with the black. Ooh, do you have a shiny Umbreon in any of your games? I do. Nice. I've got a shiny Umbreon in. Let's. Uh, uh, which one is it? The one on the the phone. Um, Pokemon Go. Pokemon Go. Yes. Nice. And then I also have a shiny Eevee in uh, Let's Go Eevee. 
and I just haven't evolved it yet because you can't evolve it to Umbreon. Right. Or you'll lose the shiny? No. It, let's go. Eevee only has the original 151. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Yeah. Just for filling my, my tea, folks. I gotta listen to Usu talk about Pokemon. This could be a long one. <laughs> <laughs> um, any particular uh, favorite me... like, episodes of Pokemon that stand out to you that you loved? Uh, my favorite episode of Pokemon was when Ash released Butterfree. Oh, bye-bye, Butterfree. Yeah. So, Ash was stupid <laughs> and let his Butterfree go. <laughs> As he does with a lot of his Pokemon. He just goes, yeah, you can go. And I'm like, but... But... You, you haven't even become a Pokemon master yet. You're letting Pokemon go already? What is wrong with you? <laughs> You're here, folks. Ash uh, is stupid. Ash is very dumb, I have come to learn over the years. Because oh he goodness. can't... So you can, you can become the Pokemon champion in any game. But Ash, Ash has only won the Alola region. Oh, seriously? Which is dumb. I didn't know that. Oh, poor Ash. Yeah. Poor Ash and letting the Butterfree go. That's your favorite episode when he let the Butterfree go, though. That is my favorite episode, yes. Because you run into a pink Butterfree. Yes. It's not even a shiny version. Like, shiny, but shiny Butterfree is not pink. What is shiny Butterfree? Shiny Butterfree is, I believe, just a different... It, it's like, it looks like Butterfree, but like slightly different. Okay, I'll take it. But yeah, that pink Butterfree was cute. I can't remember. <laughs> That's actually the most depressing episode for the bee. purple with pink hands. Okay. Instead of blue hands. So it looks exactly the same, except it has pink hands. Okay, so the shiny's got pink hands. Gotcha. Yeah. Yeah. Um, let me think. My absolute favorite memory of Pokemon is when the first movie came out. Ooh. Okay. So when the first movie came out, they gave out special cards. I still have them. Uh, they gave out a I'm... Mewtwo and a Mew. Yes. And the Mew was an ancient card. Yes, I remember that. We have them here too. Yep, yep. I have them. Um, and I, I still have one in the original packaging. I never opened it. Oh. Because I, I was like, you know what? I'm, I've gone to go see this movie four times. I've opened up three <laughs> packs. I'm just going to leave this one alone. Oh, nice. Nice. Yeah. So it's still originally wrapped. Wow. Um, but I remember seeing that movie for the first time and crying. Ex uh, yeah. Like when, when, when Pikachu was slapping the other Pikachu and started tears stalling, fall, started falling out of its face. Mm -hmm. That is the absolute saddest scene in any movie, any TV show anywhere. It's sad. It, it was. Yes, I, I agree. It's sad. For me, it may not be the saddest, but yes. For Usu. It's, and it's not even when Ash dies. It's literally when Pikachu is slapping the other Pikachu. Do y'all remember that? It's a pretty uh, emotionally charged scene for Pokemon, which was very impressive. Yeah, yeah. A really good movie, too. The remake of it was really good yes. as well. Oh, cool. Never, I never saw the remake. I didn't realize that was a good one as well. Yeah. Yeah, it, it's the exact same movie, except slightly 3D. Oh, yes, that one. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. And then... Uh, what other what other one was really good? I didn't like the Hoopa movie. I thought that one was dumb. Oh, well, I didn't see the Hoopa one. <laughs> there was, there are some Pokemon stuff that was just like, why did you come out with this? <laughs> yes, but let's not focus on those Pokemon ones. What other yeah. uh, fondness do you have of Pokemon you can regale with that Pokemon brain of yours? Um, let me think. Pursing the the Mimikyu in the the newer Sun and Moo show. Mm hmm Um, the Mimikyu in the show is actually shiny, but it's also dead. Whoa, I didn't know that. Yeah. So, um, it's the gym leader's Mimikyu, and it's literally a dead Mimikyu. It can't do anything but it's really cool looking and it follows her around like a little dog oh neat and i thought that was really cool lore you know like some of the the lore that's in the pokedex um 
take Drifloom, for instance. If you know Drifloom's Pokedex entry. I don't know Drifloom's Pokedex entry. Drifloom. Yeah. Drifloom takes children by the hand and carries them away. Seriously? Uh-huh. Just carries them away. Yep. Never to be seen again. I, never to be seen again. Wow. Drifloom is actually a very terrifying balloon. Did not know that. Yeah. Okay. Some, some Pokemon are very scary. Some Pokemon are scary. They're not just cute. So I guess the Mimikyu from the show, that was using Mimikyu lore in the Pokedex? Um, so Mimikyu's lore is it's jealous of Pikachu mm. and uses a rag that looks like Pikachu to try and create friends with other Pokemon and uh, trainers. Okay. So the lore between but behind the, the dead Mimikyu is, I guess, somebody forgot it and it died in a convenience store and the gym trader found it. Oh, okay. Wow, that's kind of a sad story. Yeah. <laughs> Fig goes. But we all know Fig's, Fig's favorite Pokemon is, is Mimikyu, of course. Yes, a, fig, a monster that hides under the, under the blanket. Indeed, Fig, indeed. Mm -hmm. the, 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 are you a Pokemon? Are you the creator of the <laughs> uh, of the Mimikyu's and and Usu has captured you? <laughs> I can buy it. You gotta catch them all. You do. You gotta catch them all. Yeah. What, so with all of my games, uh, I the way I I do Pokemon is a little bit weird. Okay. Um, besides my Nuzlocks. So what I like to do is I like to collect all of them obviously, you know, for the Pokedex. But then in the actual PC, I will put, you know, like Charmander, Charizard, or Charmeleon, Charizard, uh, all in a row, and then create the Pokedex in the PC. Uh, so I have all whatever numbers are in that game in the PC. Oh, oh, that is cool. One of each. Yeah. And you keep all their names the same? You don't nickname them, right? I don't nickname Pokemon, no. Not unless it's a Nuzlocke. Gotcha. <laughs> oh, that is neat. So you mm -hmm. you open up Usu's Pokedex or, or the PC, and you'll see them all there. They're all in a row in every single game. So which, And I collect okay. all of them. Wow. Do you do that start from scratch every time, or do you trade Pokemon over to the next, to the following game, the succeeding games? Because you could do that before. Nope. They stay in their original games. Oh, okay. You just start over again all the time. All the time. Oh my goodness. There is one game that I have. I, it's um, Sun and Moon uh, that I decided that it was going to be a shiny Dex only. <gasps> and so those are the only Pokemon that I traded over. So I traded every single Pokemon that I could find in any of my games that were shiny and put it in that game. So that is my shiny Dex game. Oh, Sun and Moon. Uh, which one is it? A Sun or Moon? In Sun and Moon. It, it's um, Sun. Wow. And how complete is that mm -hmm. dex right now? Uh, not very. Yeah, well, they are shinies. I'll give you that. But holy yeah. moly! I have I have maybe twenty. Wow. We, we, which... Out of eight hundred and something. <laughs> okay, fine, whatever. But twenty is twenty. That's twenty more than I've got. Which 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 Pokemon game has your most comprehensive list? You would say, you know, have that like. Did you ever fill the complete Pokedex? My most. Uh yeah, uh most comp or the the most completed one is Pokemon Yellow. That one's one hundred and fifty one. Oh, that one's done. But that one's completely done. And the other one that is done would be, uh, what's what's the newest one? Shield. Sword and Shield. Yeah. Yeah, I've got Shield completely done, not Sword. Oh my goodness! How much? How much is in Shield? I never kept kept track of that. Nine hundred and something. <laughs> Wait a minute. It's all of them. All of them plus the mythics plus whatever. Wait a minute. I thought they complained that, that Shield and Sword didn't have the Pokedex. Or just... There's been DLCs and up, up, updated stuff. You can give... You can put all of the Pokemon in that game. <sighs> so Sword and Shield has the most... Po has them all? Has all. Yes. Oh my goodness. Your Switch must be charging all the goddamn time or something. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's always plugged in. Um, oh, and I, I played Snap to almost completion. 
Oh, this is fantastic. Oh my goodness, yeah. this is too awesome. You got you got any more awesome shit I can't to can't help it. <laughs> Um, I think, honestly, I think, well, I, I got, I got the young raptor in my house, uh, addicted to Eevee, so. Oh, delightful. I think that's the last little bit, yeah. We're, we're all Pokemon. Nice. The little raptor and Usu, even Fig? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't know Fig that. Fig likes Mimikyu, so, yeah. All right, I'll take it. He takes Mimikyu. Mimik wow. Oh my goodness, that is too cool. That is awesome. Okay. Usu right here, a real chatette. I'm going to say that right now. <laughs> Fig, my first Pokemon game His was... His first Pokemon game was Red and Blue, yeah. Oh. We still have it, too. Fig's original Red and Blues? Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah, we still have them. Wow, I can bet. You know, mine was actually Leaf Green and Fire Red. I kind of caught on later. Oh, yeah. Those were the remakes of Red and Blue, I think? Yeah, that's, I think, why I started with that. Okay, Chia's was blue. All right. Yep, they still got it. Yep, according to Fig. Nice. Well, yeah. you know what? We're all old. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yes. yes, we are. We are. Anyway, let's not think about age. Let's give it up for Pokemon and Usu's wonderful, not so much addiction, so much I would say, love of the, love it. Love of Pokemon. Let's stick with love. It's love. It's love. not my addiction. No. No, yeah. No, 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 no. Thank nah. you, Pokemon. Thank you for providing all that for Usu. Thank you for uh, uh, being a, a source of completing a Pokedex within the PC. That is cool. And, um. Yeah. Thank you, Pokemon in general, for really being a, a, a sunshine for a lot of our childhoods, in all honesty. Let's, let's be honest yeah, here. Yeah, it's a good, a good staple in life. Yeah. Very nice to look back on. Thank you again, Pokemon. Thank you, Usu, for sharing your love of Pokemon. And with that, folks, that's celebration appreciation. Pokemon, we are going to move on to the singing corner. But first, this Jeepster does need to take a piss. So, we are going back to the standby screens. Again, thank you, Usu. Thank you, Pokemon. Thank you, Pokemon. Yeah. All right, we're Pokemon, gonna meet. Gotta catch them all. It's you and me. <laughs> I know it's my destiny. Okay, I'm done now. Okay, we'll be back, folks. Well, Tamatoa hasn't always been this glam. I was a drab little crab once. Now I know I can be happy as a clam. Because I'm beautiful, baby. Did your granny say, listen to your heart, be who you are on the inside? I need three words to tear her arguments apart. Your granny lied. I'd rather be shiny, like a treasure from a sunken pirate wreck. Scrub the deck and make it look shiny. I will sparkle like a wealthy woman's neck. <laughs> Just a sec. Don't you know, fish are dumb, dumb, dumb. They chase anything that glitters. Beginners. Oh, and here they come, come, come to the brightest thing that glitters. Hmm, fish dinners. I just love free food. And you look like seafood. Seafood. <laughs> well, well, well. Little Maui's having trouble with his look. Your little semi demi mini god. Ouch! What a terrible performance. Get the hook, get it? You don't swing it like you used to, man. Yet I have to give you credit for my start and your tattoos on the outside. For just like you, I made myself a work of art. I'll never hide. I can't. I'm too shiny. Watch me dazzle like a diamond in the rough. Strut my stuff. My stuff is so shiny. Send your armies, but they'll never be enough. My shell's too tough. Maui man, you could try, 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 but you can't expect a demigod to beat a decapod. Look it up. You will die, die, die. Now it's time for me to take apart your aching heart. Oh, far from the ones who abandon you. Chasing the love of these humans who made you feel wanted. You tried to be tough, but your armor's just not hard enough. My way! Now it's time to kick your hiney! Ever seen someone so shiny? So good in, cause it's the last you'll ever see. 
C'est la vie, mon ami. I'm so shiny. Now I'll eat you, so prepare your final plea. Just for me. You'll never be quite as shiny. You wish you were nice and shiny. If you take a life, do you know what you'll give? Odds are you won't like what it is. When the storm arrives, would you be seen with me? By the merciless eyes I've received. I've seen angels fall from blinding heights. But you yourself are nothing so divine. Just next in line. Calm yourself because no one else here will say. We are back, people. We are back. Time for some singing. We got two songs for you today, which is a nice big surprise. <laughs> Speaking of big surprise, my God, I made Usu huge. Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap! Hold on. All right, I'm gonna move her aside because this first one, well, actually, both of them, we're both gonna sing together. Mm -hmm. But um, this first one. All right. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to get in front of that wing there, my friend. Give me a second. There we go. Okay. It's fine. You can, you can step in front. There you go. Just, I just need to do it for now, folks. I need to get in front of the wing. I know we like putting the guests up front, but... Yep. Just gotta step side it. Yep. There you go. There we go. Delightful. Delightful. Okay. Now let me... Uh, Let's see. What kind of background should we go for this first song? Um, I think... This one. <laughs> the sunny one. Let me think. 
I want that one. So that yeah, I think this works for it. It's just it's just like too damn funny not to have this one. What do you think? You like this one? Yeah, yeah, no, this works. This is perfect. All right, here's yeah. our here's our. So it's going to be a cappella. We can't do music for various scuff reasons, but bear with us. Mm -hmm. This song I suggested just now. So I want you all to get ready for some amazing singing. Hap at the crumpet. Crumpet! Rating with a party of 11! Hey. Crumpet Woo. love, thank you! Oh my goodness. Thank you for the raid. According to Toxicalis, uh, just been nest, uh, Paper Gauntlet, just been nest, yep. Post Boredom Killer, just been nest. Holy, mo the tits are just been yes. Uh, thank you! <laughs> thank you for the follow up, Toxicalis! I think I think I pronounced it right. It's Eggs Benedict! This, you all, Paper Gauntlet, you're all from Cat! This is Cat's group! Cat Pernicus! Paper Gauntlet, thank you for the follow! I've just been nished, evidently, and you all are coming to the singing segment. Mm -hmm. This is beautiful. Holy cool, Kamoli. Got here just in time. Post post boredom Keeler, thank you for the follow. Thank you, thank you, Crumpet. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness, Crumpet love. I I should have known. I I'm so sorry. I didn't know you streamed. Welcome. By the way, folks, okay, I normally do the show by myself. Jeep variety, Jeep variety, Jeep variety show. I am Jeep for those of you joining me. This is my variety show. I have guests, and tonight we have the very lovely, very talented, very, very awesome, adorable bat right beside me. Her name is Usuki. Let me spell it. Eggs, Eggs Benedict. Thank you for the follow. Her, so her name is spelled Usuki right here. You can find her on Twitter. Um, her Twitter is Usuki. Uh, come on. There we go. Usuki1. Right there. It's just that simple. Yep. And um, she is the wife of my mod in the chat right here, Kinnear Fig. Uh, Tostocles says loves the model. Thank you, Tostocles. Thank you. Um, so I run a variety show, and I, like I said, I have guests on. We have skits and games and interviews and singing at the end, like a typical talk show, but with a lot of several segments. And so, Usu, tell them a little about yourself. Uh, so I'm Usu, I'm uh, Bat Demon, and I stream Pokemon, Digimon, uh, platformers, some scary games. I just played Manhunter, or Maneater? Maneater. Um, Maneater. Yeah, and uh, my affiliate party is actually this Saturday. <gasps> no way! Yeah. The Tizzer, thank you for the follow. I thought you were going to be out of town Saturday. Don't worry, don't spoil too much. I, I... Uh, not this Saturday, next Saturday. Oh, next the 11th. Saturday. The 11th. Okay, oh wow. The oh, 11th. I got to be there for that. Yeah. Next, next Saturday. Affil oh, that's right. I wonder when you do the affiliate part. So you heard that, folks? Pokemon. Oh, and she has hit. She got some Pokemon stories. You all should watch this VOD and jump to the segment. Here, let me show you what, what I'm talking about. If you look through the VOD, you'll see the segment of Celebration Appreciation Corner, which in that corner, we celebrate... Oh. A works of entertainment that we love, and um, here Usu celebrated her love of Pokemon, and oh, she got some stories on there. So if you have time to check out the VOD, naturally, it's probably late for most of you. So I'm just gonna entertain y'all while you're here. I'm very really grateful for you showing up. So let's now let's get back to the singing corner. So anyway, bu 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 let's dance deep back over here. So yes, Usu, very delightful person. Her husband Fig. Equally as delightful, maybe a little less so because Usu's on stage right now, so I'm gonna say she's better. And um <laughs> <laughs> But yes. And while I'm at it, I forgot to make a shout out to this very special person, the very wonderful Alicorn, um, who helped me with a game on that I have on this show. Her name is Fuaku Uni, and she's part of Team Starstruck. They're all a lovely band. And she helped me with a video game. I'm sorry, Fig, I had to do it. I had to I had to talk up Usu. You're not on the show today. You're you're in the chat. Usu's the guest. Guests reign overall. At least on Jeep Show. Anyway, Fuwaku Uni. This is her name. And without her, I would not have had this awesome, awesome, very fun um, improv corner that I've got. So, you were not... Oh, you were part of the Pokemon game. That's right, you were part of it. But you're not the guest, Fig. You're not the guest. Don't worry, folks. Fig and I always have this bantering going on. Oh, yes. And by the way, that name in the chat. Yes, Fig is how you can pronounce his name. That Kanrir Fug. It's pronounced Kanir Fig. That's why I call him Fig. Just a simple F-I-G, Fig. So just just a heads up. So yes, Fuwako Uni, part of Team Starstruck. You can find her anywhere. She she streams on YouTube, and thanks to her, I have this awesome PowerPoint improv game. She's a wonderful person. Check her out. Okay, now the most wonderful person right now is Usu, and we are about to sing a song for y'all. For those of you mm -hmm. familiar with Pokemon, 
it's uh, a Pokemon song. So let's not dilly daddle and let's get right onto that, shall we? Yes, let's shout. All right, you ready, Usu? I'm ready. Here we go. Come on, start up. We gotta wrap some Pokemon. You just, you just do the thinking. I'll take care of the hard part. Let's get it on. I want to be the best. It's gotta be acapella. Like I said, there ever was to beat all the rest. Yeah, that's my cause. Electro, Diglett, Nidoran, Mankey, Venusaur, Rattata, Fero, Pidgey, Sink King, Jolteon, Dragonite, Ghastly, Ponyta, Vaporeon, Polyrath, Butterfree. Catch them, catch them, gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all. Pokemon, I'll search across the land. Look far and wide, release from my hand, the power that's inside. Mm. Venomoth, Poliwag, Nidorino, Golduck, Ivysaur, Grimer, Victor Bell, go, Moltres, go, go. Nidoking, Farfetch'd, Abra, Jigglypuff, Kingler, Rhyhorn, right. Clefable, Wigglytuff. Catch em, catch em, gotta catch em all, gotta catch em all, Pokemon. Mm. Zubat, Primate, Meowth. Onyx, Geodude, Rapidash, Magneton, Snorlax, Gengar, Tangela, Goldene, Spearow, Weezing, Seal, Gyarados, Slowbro! Yes, gotta catch them all, gotta catch them all, yeah! Gotta catch them all, gotta catch them all, yeah! Gotta catch them all, Pokemon! Yeah! Kabuto, Persian, Paris, Horsey, Raticate, Magnemite, Kadabra, Weeping Bell, Ditto, Cloister, Caterpie, Sandshrew, Bulbasaur, Charmander, Golem, Pikachu! At least 150 or more to see. To be a Pokemon Master is our destiny! Get it on! Alakaz, Zam, Kangaskhan, Hypno, Electabuzz, Flareon, Blastoise, Poliwhirl, Oddish, Charles Z, Raichu, Nidoqueen, Bellsprout, Starmie! Starmie! Starlight! Starmie Light! We're almost there! Wait, what's all this wee stuff? I'm doing all the damn hard work. Well, of course, I'm talking to myself, but it's okay. Break time's over. Here we go! Metapod, Marowak, Kakuna, Clefairy, Dedrio, Spat. <laughs> Krabby, Licka King, Tauros, Weedle, Nidoran, Machop, Shelder, Porygon, Hitmonchan. Yeah, Licka Dog, gotta catch them all, gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all, gotta catch them all, yeah. Articuno, Jinx, Nidorina, Bel B Hunter, oh my god, Chansey. Chansey, execute. Parasect, Muck, Dugon, Pidgeotto, Lapras, Vulpix. Right on! At least 150 or more to see. To be a Pokemon master is Usu's destiny! Yeah! Charizard, Machamp, Pinsir, Coughing, Dugtrio, Golbat, Star, You, Magikarp, Ninetail, Zekins, Amastar, Slyther, Tentacruel, Dragonar, Magmar. Magmar! Whoa! Catch your breath, girl! Shake out those lips! Oh no, I said the wrong way at the wrong time. It's down here from here! Just 24 <laughs> more to go! Now it gets tricky, so listen real good. Panslash, Hitmonlee, Psyduck, Arcanine, Eevee, Exit, Cobjax, Jatini, Growler, Mr. Mime, Mr. Mime Q, Q, Bone Growler, Voltorb Glue. We're almost home! Gotta catch them all, gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all, gotta catch them all. Yeah! Gotta catch them all, Pokemon! Yeah! Grand Finale! Charmeleon. Charmeleon. Wartortle. Mewtwo. Mewtwo. Pentacruel. Aerodactyl. Ammonite. Ammonite. Slowpoke. Pidgeot. Pidgeot. Oh, Arbuck. That's all, folks! Catch em, catch em, gotta catch em all. Gotta catch em all. Pokemon! Catch em, okay, catch em, gotta catch em all. Gotta catch em all. Sing with me, Usu. Pokemon! Pokemon! Catch em, catch em, gotta catch em all. Gotta catch em all. Pokemon! Pokemon! Yeah! Goodbye, ad. <laughs> <laughs> Delightful! Now! We did that song first because we are not very skilled at it to lower your expectations for what comes next, a real banger mm -hmm. that Usu is going to own. This is her official song. Now, let's see. What kind of background do you like, Usu? Let me uh, share my screen again with you so you can decide for yourself which um, one is best. So we got one more song for you folks. Let's see. Here we go. So let me show you my background so you have... 
Thank you, Pachi Pachi. Thank you, Chad. Thank you, Okami. Thank you, Crumpet. Thank you. And thank you for the raid. Pachi. All right, so here's some of the backgrounds I've got. So we've got this, like, this uh, psychedelic cyber -y one here. We've got this uh, shining star one. Let's see, what kind of suits this one? That, that, that looks like a good one for it. Kind of misty like that. Oh, maybe that one. Oh, that one. Yeah. Okay, yeah. That, yeah. There we go. That one. All right. Again, acapella, folks, we have to do this one because, again, scuff issues. But, uh, yes. Let's get on with the song, shall we? Yes, I say yes. All right, you ready? Let me bring up my lyric sheet so I can make sure I'm, uh -huh. I'm saying the right ones when you give me the cue. All right. Yep. I am ready to take it away whenever you are ready. Oh, wait, hold on. All hold right. on, hold on, hold on. We're not exactly equal in this. I'm, I sing along with the chorus. I want to put you in the center. So let me <laughs> fix that up. Get away, Jeep. This is Usu's show. All right. We don't want to see you up front. We want the star of the show. Giant Usu. Yeah. There you go. Bring the microphone up a little bit. And then Jeep, take a back seat. All right. Let me, uh, that looks weird. Here we go. Got a little, 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 little minor Jeep right here, right next to Usu's tail to make sure that he doesn't, you know, try anything. That that, that will just whip him in the face. There we Tiny go. Tail. Yes. Okay, there we go. Now that we got this set up, let me get my lyrics back up. Usu, take it away whenever you're ready, my friend. All right. Don't know how you met me. You don't know why you can't turn around and say goodbye. All you know is when I'm with you, I make you free. I'm swim through your veins like a fish in the sea I'm singing follow, follow me and everything is all right I'll be the one to tuck you in at night and if you want to leave I can guarantee you won't find nobody else like me Sing it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm not worried about the ring you wear. Cause as long as no one knows and nobody can care. You're feeling guilty and I'm well aware. But you don't look ashamed and baby I'm not scared. I'm singing. Follow, Follow me, me and everything, everything is all right. right. I'll, I'll be the one, one to tuck you in at night. And if you want to leave, I can guarantee you won't find nobody else like me. I'm not worried about the ring you wear. Because as long as no one knows and nobody can care. You're feeling guilty, and I'm well aware. But you don't look ashamed, and baby, I'm not scared. I'm singing, follow me, and everything is all right. I'll be the one to tuck you in at night. And if you wanna leave, I can guarantee you won't find nobody else like me. Won't give you the money, well, I can't give you the sky. You're better off if you don't ask why. I'm not the reason that you go astray. We'll be alright if you don't ask me to stay. Follow me, me and everything is all alright. I'll be the one to tuck you in at night. And if you want to leave, I can guarantee you won't find nobody else like me. You don't know how you met me. You don't know who I am. Can't turn around and say goodbye. All you know when I'm with you, I'll make you free. 
And swim through your veins like a fish in the sea. I'm singing, follow, follow me, me and everything is all right. I'll be the one to tuck you in at night. And if you want to leave, I can guarantee you won't find nobody else like me. I'm singing, follow me, and everything is all right. I'll be the one to tuck you in at night. And if you want to leave, I can guarantee you won't find nobody else like me. I'm singing, follow me, and everything is all right. I'll be the one to tuck you in at night. If you want to leave, I can guarantee you won't find nobody else like me. Yeah, hey! Uh, give it up, Monty, Monty, Monty! Nice and done, Usu! I think we... I, I, I can't wait to see the playback. I think we sound good together, I'm hoping. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone, for joining for that one. That's the song that Usu owns! Yes, nailed it indeed, Chia. It worked. The strategy worked, Usu. <laughs> yeah. We lowered your expectations with our scuffed-as-fuck poke rap, and then hit ya with some killer vocals from Usu here. That was her song. Punch in the face. Yeah. Bet y'all didn't see that one coming, given how we, we started. <laughs> 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 Again, Crumpet Love, thank you so much for the for the raid. And um, so anyway, this is actually the end of our show, however. So um, mm -hmm. with that, I think we should move on over to, let me just uh, get back to the main stage here. And let's wrap up with our wonderful guest. Nicely done, Usu. You really can sing that song. Yeah, yeah. It's the, the one and only song I can actually sing. <laughs> yes, folks. <laughs> but you do it well. That's what matters. And you have a good time with it. Yes. Give it up for Usu yet again, folks. Thank you so much, Usu. Really. Um, so there yeah, she no is. No problem. And she is a Twitch streamer. So she is very rateable, which is very fun to do. You know, as opposed to YouTube streamers, which you can't do that with. But, um, like myself, because it just happened. <laughs> God, that sounded so weird. Anyway, um, <laughs> Crumpet, Jeep, you are a treat. Usuki, congrats on affiliates. Oh, thank you, Crumpet. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Wow, that's real sweet. Thank you. So, yes, take a look again at those up there. Yeah, you just type in Usuki on Twitch. That's just her name up there. There's nothing else in No, No underscores. It's just Usuki. But of course, please, mm -hmm. call her Usu. And I don't think I should have to spell that for all of y'all. At least I hope not. <laughs> anyway, with that, I'm going to now, before we go back to Usu, who's going to hype you for what she has in store for everybody, let me uh, hype you all for my next guest, which will be on Friday. Today is Thursday. Today is not my typical guest day. However, Usu needed me to choose today because she wouldn't have been available for Friday. Thank you, Fake, for linking her in the chat. Linking those, your, 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 your lovely wife and wonderful guest. So, next week, Friday, September the 10th at 12 p.m. PST time or PDT. I use PST because it's what I grew up with. I know it should be technically PDT, but you know what? Whatever. And my next guest is a rather popular one, but outside of our usual VTuber circles. And there's a reason why I reached out to her, and I'm so glad she said yes. Uh, this guest is, does anyone know, Mooney Kaya. Munikaya. Um, she, in in a, in a great way, is very uh very kind. Helped me rig my model. Actually, not that I reached out to her. She does rigging tutorials, and with that, the person who actually rigged my model actually learned from Munikaya. Her tutorials were the most, I think, was the most easy to digest and comprehensive and understandable and just generally nice to listen to. However, herself also she streams on Twitch though. She's not just she doesn't just make tutorials. She does stream on Twitch, and she's an Apex player. Mega Apex player. So, she can kick some ass in Apex Legends. So, Mooney Kaya. Call her Mooney. She is also on Twitch. That is going to be next week, Fridays, September the 10th, 12 p.m. PST. Mark your calendars, folks. 
and let's get back to the screen here. Now, before I go any farther, before we send them off, before we leave off here, Usu, please hype up what you have in store in the immediate future, as well as your affiliate next week. They know that. But what else you got coming up? All right. So in the immediate future, I have my Pokemon Nuzlocke that's actually going to continue that Friday prior. Um, I won't be streaming until then, though, because I'm very, very busy, uh, unfortunately. So on the 10th, I'll be streaming Pokemon at my usual time of 4 p.m. Pacific time. Um, and then on Saturday, the 11th, we're going to do my affiliate party at 4 p.m. as well. And there's going to be special prizes and treats involved, uh, which I can't wait for. Um, I think I'm going to do some sub goals this month uh, because it is September, September, whatever it is. <laughs> um, uh, if I get enough subs, then I will do an art stream and uh, maybe a, a VTube tutorial thing on how I made my rig. Yes, she did all herself. Um, and I'm th I'm I'm slowly coming up with goals. Uh, once I once I hit one, I'll probably come up with more. But that's pretty much all I've got going on right now. It's just those two those two streams, um, and I'll know more the week after. All right. So the big one is the affiliate one, and say for us again the most immediate one before that. The one most immediate before that is Friday, uh, the tenth at four p.m. and that is my Pokemon Nuzlocke. 4 p.m. PST, Pokemon Nuzlocke. Check that one out. That's the most immediate. Then followed swiftly by, uh, that is, and then September 11th, right? That's your affiliate. September 11th is the is the affiliate party. And yes, I know I chose a weird date. <laughs> I apologize. So, right. Sometimes we need to choose the weird dates for some uplifting uh, feels. So. Yes. Let's make it a day of celebration. Not always, not always. It, ha it doesn't always have to be a day of mourning. I mean, it's good to mourn, but not exactly. a day of depression. Let's say that. Morning is good. I'm going to try and make it into a very happy day. Yes. So look forward to that. Back to back Usu streams next Friday, next Saturday. Give it up again for my lovely guest, Usuki. Let's see the Pachi Pachi and cheers. Pachi Pachi Pachi. Usu, thank you so much for coming on the show. I, I got some great content out of this. But more than that, you're a delight to hang out with. So. Yeah, it was a pleasure. Yes. No, thank you, Chia God. Thanks for being on the show. It says Chia God, Usu Pachi Pachi. Fig says worst. Well, Hey, hey, he misspelled that. Nope. Fig can't spell. Worst guest ever? Where's your T, Fig? Uh-huh. You forgot to cross the T, but you managed to circle your E. And... <laughs> <laughs> Normally, I'm the bad speller. Mm. Sorry, Fig. In the, I know what you were going for, but you messed up. She's not worth it. <laughs> sure, whatever, Fig. <laughs> Just remember, folks, Fig and Usa are married, so... That's why their banter is so colorful. I'll use the word colorful. Oh, and this banter goes on in everybody's chat. So if you end up raiding me, I will probably raid you in the future. And this this banter will go on. <laughs> they That's have just for future notification. Yep. Just 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 for your knowledge, folks. Just just so you know. Okami David says, imagine not being able to spiel. Exactly, David. Exactly. All right, folks. <laughs> and with that, Usu, I always give this to my guests. Who would you like me to raid? We're going to raid out to somebody. It'll be your choice. Uh, let me see. Who do I have on? Um, let us raid. Thank you, Kitsu, Okami. Kitsu. Kitsu, Kitsu? Okay. Let yep, me, uh... she's playing Mira Tanama. All right, Kitsu. Kitsu. She's real sweet. Don't forget, she's got an underscore. Yep, yep. I, I have her up here on the Twitch. So we're going to raid Kitsu, Kitsu, folks. And let's have in the chat... Um, Thanks for coming, Okami. Yes, no, thank you, Okami. I always like seeing you in the chat. Okami is a really nice delight. Okami likes to join also my Kadoki stream, so it's a very fun supporter. I knew, I forgot that Okami was mm -hmm. on your stream, but I, then I remembered when you were playing Pokemon. Anyway, folks, we are going to raid Kits Kitsu, so let me get that up and running. Um, oh, no, good night, Krubin. Thank you for the, thank you for everything. Thank you for the raid. You're going to get a shout-out for certain. I hope I'll get your name right on Twitter. <laughs> Can you drop your Twitter name in here for me so that I make sure I, I, I that you get tagged in the, in the tweet? If you have a Twitter. Otherwise, don't worry about it. Yeah, no, thank you, Chia. Thank you all so much for coming. Thank you, Fig, for being a pain in the ass and a delight as usual. Thank, uh, thanks, thanks for Usu. 
being an awesome guest and all that jazz. And we are going to raid Kitsu Kitsu. So let's have the message raid. Let's call it. Let's call it Usu raid. Usu raid. Uh, sh shadow shadow the uh, raid from the shadows is usually what I say. But so ah. so Usu or shadow. Let's see, Shadow Jeep Raid. There we go. Let's go with that. Shadow Jeep Raid. Shadow Jeep Raid. There we go. Shadow Jeep yeah. Raid. That's what we're gonna go with. Shadow Jeep Raid. That's what we're gonna say, folks. Shadow yep. Jeep Raid. And use your use your emotes if you have them too. Yep. So I want to see plenty of Shadow Jeep raids again. Give it up for my wonderful guest Usu. She was splendid. She was awesome. She jam packed the show with like every fucking corner that I have available. So I'm so <laughs> happy I managed to run through them all. This was a great night. So. With that, folks, I'm about to run out of time. So as I always say to my viewers, everybody, stay cool and stay sharp. Jeep and Usuki out to raid Kitsukitsu!